Hey, what's hopping everyone? Fishbulg here, welcome to the stream. I am sweaty as hell today. I actually just got home from work like 30 minutes ago. Um, and I thought it would be a great idea to wear this black shirt and some jeans to work. <laughs> so I was melting my ass off today, it got so hot. And then I like went outside for lunch and I was just baking in the heat. I think miraculously I'm not sunburned, although I might be speaking too soon because it's very possible that tomorrow morning I wake up and I'm just bright red. Um, yeah. So I could be like a little tomato man, but um, we're gonna hope that that doesn't happen. And anyway, today we are playing Lobotomy Corporation. I realized that yesterday I said it had been a week since I last played and I actually streamed it on Monday. But you know what, we're just gonna write that off. Uh, and we're gonna play more Lobotomy Corporation. We are on day 22. And we have some core suppressions to do today, which I've never done before, so we're going to find out how that goes. But um, it should be interesting. So we're going to have to put all of the people in the, the department we're suppressing on the bench and just kind of deal. So we'll see how this goes. Um, anything else? So yesterday after stream, uh, <laughs> I put this on my Twitter, but, uh, so after I signed off, I was gonna go to bed, but then it was just, like, bugging me, because I'm a video game addict, um, that we had not managed to beat, what's it, um, challenge level 7 on inscription. So I played a little bit off stream, I played, like, two or three attempts, and on my last one I managed to win. I did record it, the sound balance is god-awful. But, uh, I will be uploading that. I'm probably gonna, like, try to edit it down a bit. Um, but there's not really much I can do about the sound balance. It's more just gonna be, like, a condensed... Like, this is what happened in Challenge Level 7. But, we didn't unlock any new challenges for Challenge Level 8, which means that we still need to do the exact same thing again. So, you didn't miss much. <laughs> um, yeah, but that'll be going on YouTube eventually. Uh, there are like a lot of VODs that I have not yet uploaded and they are all just kind of waiting for me to chop them up um, and then rendering videos takes a long ass time so uh, I'm gonna have to find some free time for that. Tomorrow I can't because I'm working but maybe on Sunday I'll try to get some of that done. Uh, so expect at least like one or two VODs going up on Sunday. Um, yeah, anyway, uh, that's kind of a tangent. But we are doing this crap. So we've got two new abnormalities here. A large many-eyed bird that patrols the dark forest with an everlasting lamp. Unlike regular birds, it lacks wings and has long arms instead, with which it can pick things up. Okay, so we've got a long-armed bird with a lamp, and I forget what we got here. It was something that I've seen before, wasn't it? Or maybe not. Um, whatever. So this is our third timeline, so it's the Gamma timeline, and then I think it's like we branched this timeline because I did not like what was going on in the safety team. So we, uh, we kind of reset and got different dudes here because we got like an Aleph and we got the fucking demon parasite tree. So, um, let's whack out a core suppression, that was probably a terrible way to put that and let's hire a new person so I think right now we're just gonna hire a NPC <laughs> because yeah we were only bringing in chat members to be um, department heads and so for expanding this department we will Try to find someone interesting. Diva? Do we not already have someone named Diva? I hope everyone's having a wonderful Friday. <laughs> Forgot that that's the day that it is today. Since I didn't work yesterday and I did today. Uh, kind of kind of a weird vibe. We could take Angry Isabel. And then we were upgrading like every stat, weren't we? For 13 lob. So that's three in each stat and then two in Justice. Um... But yeah, let's bring her on. Alright, Angry Isabel. And we'll give her some clothes. 
because Lord knows she needs them. Okay, so take... What does this do? Additional white damage for a certain amount of time. Ooh. Kind of weird, but... Sure. <laughs> oh, shit, and we got Wa Green Stem. Once realizing that nobody would come, stems and leaves blossomed as if by magic. Wait. But we didn't get a Wa weapon. Who did we even get this from? Is it you? Oh, we didn't get any weapons from it, that's why. So the... The other weapon is from this guy? Yeah, pleasure is from him. Okay. So let's give Isabel a green stem. That looks good. And then does everyone else have hay level armor? Or, I mean, above hay. Christopher Realism Anthony. So Anthony, Christopher. Christopher can't even equip it. Anthony can equip it. Now who's more valuable to us? Probably Anthony, right? Yeah, I mean they're roughly the same, but I'll give it to Anthony, because why not? And then we can give Christopher... Oh, but I like the, the aesthetic of this one better. <laughs> Right, but yeah, Christopher is the one with the fucking, the, uh, the nerfed prudence, terrible SP, scuffed as hell. Okay, so I guess we might as well just start core suppression, right? Let's hope this goes okay. Uh-oh. Okay. <laughs> Holy shit, what is that? I don't know what that means. Okay, so I guess we want to just stay away from there. This is terrifying. <laughs> That's terrifying. Okay. The music is sick though. Holy shit. This is a banger. That doesn't look like a bird at all to me. Alright, let's send Sin and see how this goes. And I'll send Isabel to use this. Dude, this goes hard. This is what I call a truly uncool something. What? We're just getting messages on the screen? Holy shit. Is this music just gonna go on forever? Wait, all work is unknown now? Why is that happening? Is it because she's rampaging? Holy shit. <laughs> Alright, go Sim. I wanna see what this book does too. Um, what did that do? The employee who reads this book will experience an increase in prudence. Ooh. Okay. Use it again. Dude, this saga is so good. What does that say? Everything's all... Jumbled up, messed up, flustered, ha ha ha, this is what you call a truly uncontrollable situation, manager. Is it? Is this truly uncontrollable? We got skin prophecy. Uh, his lamp is lit up. <laughs> it's just blasting in my ears. I'm gonna lose my mind. After five employees died within the facility, the Cleepoth counter decreased. However, deaths caused by execution bullets were not recognized. Oh, that's bad. When the work result was bad, the counter decreased. Okay. That's bad. So we finally got a guy who gets upset when people escape. Or when people die, rather. Who escapes when people die. Bro. Uh, I just wanted to help out. Well, you're not helping now. Oh my god. The book can be read until one's prudence reaches its limit. And then what? What happens when it reaches its limit? Nothing. Okay, just keep using it. We're gonna see what happens here. Meanwhile, the music just stopped. Is it gonna start back up again? 
Oh, when the result was good, the counter increased. Okay. It breached its containment unit regardless of its counter when the emergency in the facility reached the second trumpet. Oh, that's wonderful. There was a blackout in the department where it was roaming. Employees who are in the department with a blackout may become enchanted by it. That's scary. What does this mean? The more one reads, the more they will become vulnerable to white damage. Those who open the book will be enlightened to unimaginable truths. The ones who have mastered the truths will be called by the prophets. This call cannot be de denied. <laughs> An ancient looking religious book that rests on top of a skinny lectern. Its numerous pages are written on old parchment. Its believers prayed that its sanctity would last forever by binding the tome in disgusting. Okay, so it's just the more you use it, your SP damage goes up. And that's a different song. Unique chat for the alg in case they check if the message is the same as past. You're a fucking bot, dude. <laughs> An employee who panics after reading this book will perish immediately. Okay, so the book sucks. It increases prudence, but it uh it increases white damage too. So that kind of defeats the purpose of increasing prudence. We need to get to meltdown level six with this going on. Let's send Anthony. Let's send Matt. Wait, let's send Mac here. Oh. Whatever. This is so fucking cool. <laughs> Yo, Weaboo Jones, why don't you send some unique, unique messages? Like, random combination of letters and numbers, like a Google Chrome suggested password. <laughs> I'm so flustered. This music too intense, right? <laughs> this is just gonna go play all day, and we have three of these to do. I don't know, man. The way you typed that was like you're... You're, uh, spamming your keyboard. I feel like that's not completely unique. It's possible that someone typed that same combination. I could have done it. You could have done it. You still can do it. It's unique enough, I guess. <laughs> oh fuck. What does that mean? I knew I didn't have any right to participate in the experiment. Uh. So. Oh, we didn't give Neville a new weapon, but that's good, I think? What the fuck? Now we're just underwater, I guess? This is a lot less intense. This is what you call a... Uh, yeah, I already read that one. Yo, the fucking text going across the screen is like Danganronpa vibes. Even though it's not related at all. Make sure you feel this horrible something something. This is okay, yeah. Can you like say the new things with enough time for me to actually read them? It's unpredictable, isn't it? I knew I didn't have any in the experiment. That's why something. Which one are you doing? The first one? Yeah, I'm doing the first one. I was just gonna do them in order. <laughs> what is happening though? Why? Why did I get a trumpet? Oh, fuck. Snow White's apple escaped. Uh... <laughs> Let's let it spread those roots and then deal with it later. Why did it do that? Yikes. <laughs> Dude, the music, <laughs> holy shit. Okay, where's it going? There it is. Alright, everyone, suppress. They're not gonna make it in time, are they? Don't send Isabel. Or send. Yeah, this is already too late, maybe. Yep, okay, you guys get out. Um, is it safe to leave them in this room? I guess we can find out. Uh oh. Uh, that was a mistake. Shield them? I forgot about that. <laughs> I forgot that that was a mechanic. Yeah, um, so that was a learning experience.
That music is insane. I wonder if I should turn it down a little bit. Core suppression. Go. It is insane. <laughs> How loud is it? I could turn it down. Oh, it was a little louder than it needed to be. I don't know how that happened. Alright, let's just send Isabel here. And then Summer goes here. What was the, like, trigger here? Normal, bad. That's it. Just don't be normal, don't be bad. I love the music, though. It's so good. Alright, do any of these guys need training? Let's level up Vincent V's stats a little bit. I could have done it. So I'm guessing they have unique messages depending on uh, who you're suppressing. Kinda cool. Do you know what core suppressing does? Uh, no. But, we'll find out. <laughs> I know that they go like fucking batshit crazy. That's common. Sin is panicking. Don't tell me. Don't don't tell me. <laughs> Please and thank you. Look at someone when hit blue on them. I don't know what that means. Did we just kill Sin? Why the fuck did we kill him? Working on? Look at someone when they're working? Okay. <laughs> Wait. There we go, that's why. Okay. So, look at someone while they're working, you said. Each course suppress has its own gimmick? Okay. So let's send Anthony. Uh... Yeah, nothing's happening. <laughs> we'll figure it out. It's fine. <laughs> Why is it going so shit, though? Look at the right? Of what? <laughs> Uh, you, go work. Like, on their character? Oh, is it because all their stats are plus one? No, that's normal. You'll figure it out, I'm a watch, okay. <laughs> I... don't see anything weird happening. This dude's audibly grinding his teeth, though. Alright. Uh, low, very low. Okay. Let's, uh, both Junior here. I see that there's, like, question marks on these. I'll figure it out. <laughs> I will figure it out. Um... Let's send Pocky here. Get that blessing. Why is it question marks? I don't know. Oh, wait! Oh, I get it now. Fucking hell. That's so... <laughs> Are you serious? So that's why we did such a shit job. It makes them do a random work. That's why Snow White fucking escaped. Yeah, it swaps the type of work. That's terrible. It's the same till Meltdown? Oh, okay. I'm never gonna, like, remember that shit, though. So we know this one... ...doesn't change. Uh... Wait, this guy doesn't even do temperance work. What? How did we do temperance work with him? I guess he has a stat specifically for when this happens. Okay, let's send Anthony. Be 
you can test stuff on one sim. Oh, like it's universally swapped? Oh. Okay, well, so instinct is still the same. Um, or, yeah, in, what the fuck is it called? Insight is now repression. Which means I should send both Junior to do insight work and sin here. Fuck. Uh oh. Okay. So, let's see what. Yeah, let's see what this is now. Let's see what instinct is. Now instinct is repression. <laughs> uh, I'm never gonna keep track of this. I will never be able to keep track. Uh, you. I'll send Neville because he doesn't have a weapon. Let's send Isabel here. That's fucking dumb. <laughs> I don't remember seeing that when I read it. Okay. So, in that case... So, instinct is now repression. Insight... Is, uh... Insight. Okay, <laughs> that's the same. Insight is insight, instinct is repression. Uh, so let's send you to do temperance work. Okay, so then for that one, it's just repression and instinct are swapped. So you go do repression, you go do instinct. Oh my god, okay. And then... Neville, go work. What a pain in my ass Malkuth is. <laughs> Alright, Anthony, go. And... Let me just double check. Yes, okay, they are swapped. So you go do refreshing work. Wait, so then which stat does it level up? <laughs> I guess it's leveling up instinct because they're doing instinct. That's so scuffed. Okay. So, I already got most of these guidelines. Okay, instinct and attachment. The one they are working on. Okay. So, the one that they lied to me about. Alright, go send. Nice. Snow White's apple still hasn't melted down. Let's leave it alone now. Uh, I guess I'll send Vincent V here. Oh, we're getting a Dawn Ordeal. Soon. This is not ideal. No, you're doing okay. Wow, yeah. Also, this guy's just a wall, so it could be worse. He could be an Ayla. At least I think he's a wall. I should have got basic info. Um, weak to white damage, cleave off the counter 5. We don't get to see the counter, though? Okay. So now let's... Send... Mac... Wait, is that minus 8%? That is. Never mind. Let's send Anthony here. Alright, now we're getting an ordeal. Oh god, run. Wait, but... Not you. Y'all go. Stop him! Stop him! Oh my god. <laughs> Wait, did it die? How did it die? I think it just popped because it sucked the boxes. Uh, okay. So we need to make it 2-6. 
or past six. Oh, now we have to figure out this shit again. Okay, so Anthony. Insight is still insight. Are these just gonna be like permanently swapped the way they're swapped? Vincent V. No, okay. <laughs> so temperance is repression now. You'll figure that out? Okay. I guess something's gonna happen, huh? <laughs> So Temperance is Repression, so let's set Volg Jr. to do Temperance. We have to figure out which one's Instinct. Who's a good one to test Instinct on? This guy? Go. Instinct is still Instinct, which means Temperance and Repression are traded. That's it. Oh, so it just swaps two every time. They're not all shuffled. At least that's the pattern I'm seeing so far. Which means we cannot train Repression on this guy, because he does not have Temperance work. Uh, but, that means we can just send back here. We can send Sin here. We can send Christopher? No, Neville here. You just got lucky? Oh, they are all shuffled? Well, how do we keep getting consistently lucky? <laughs> I have not seen a single time where it's been completely shuffled. It's always like something that I do is just the same. Uh, that was really bad. Wait, that was really bad. Uh, so Sin has a gun. You do black damage, so you should get out. You should stop him. Wait, no, you do red damage. Um... Yikes. If Sin just kills everyone, I'm gonna lose my mind. Um, stop that, please. Please stop that. Please stop. No. Please stop. Please stop. Okay, there we go. Oh, we saved him. Okay, let's heal a little bit, because I don't want that shit happening again. That was so bad, he almost killed Isabel. Okay, why is this one down? Where did my boxes go? Are my boxes getting drained? Okay, so... We still need more basic info about this guy. I might try and send the- oops, nope. Send the Bulb Jr. Because at least he won't go crazy. Alright, we have a meltdown coming up soon. Someone ordered a meltdown? I just need 11 boxes here. Perfect. So it's a Wa Big Bird <laughs> from Sesame Street. He gives you a lamp helmet. Lamp. HP plus three, success rate plus three, work speed plus three. That's a good helmet. We don't have enough observation level to see what the ego stuff is. But he's still at five uh, countdown, so that's good. Um, all right, last two. Let's send Mac here. Let's send Anthony here. We have a noon ordeal coming up. Are they gonna make me do a fucking dusk ordeal in order to suppress this core? Oh, and right, we need to figure out what these stats are. Okay, so Narai, you're doing that one. Oh, wait. What do you do? Um... Okay, so it's okay if we use the wrong thing here. And what stats do they need? 3-3. Three, three. Okay. 
so we could send anyone here. Let's send Vincent B. And then... Let's send Summer here. Okay, wait. So... Fortitude is repression. Uh, insight... Wait, that was ta attachment, right? So attachment is insight. <laughs> insight is... Instinct. Okay. So it's insight is instinct, instinct is repression, attachment is insight, and I guess repression is... Temperance. Repression is... is, uh, yeah. This one. Attachment. Holy shit, I'm not gonna remember that. <laughs> okay, wait, so it's... Blue... Red... White... Blue, red, white, purple. Oh, and you need to use that. What is wrong with this guy? Why are you having, like, a issue over here? Blue, red, white, purple, which means you're blue. You're red. Wait, can I just... No, you suck. Yeah. It only likes high repression. Okay, blue, red, white, purple. Sin, don't go crazy, please. Uh, blue, red, white, purple. There's more melting down, right? It's... Wait, one, two... Did we already get to all of them? Blue, red, white, purple. Please hurry. Thank you. Okay. Are they just cycling through the whole OST at this point? <laughs> Blue, red, white, purple. It's so far. That meltdown is so far. <laughs> uh, blue, red, white, purple. Oh, he got the little flower. I hope we don't lose here. <laughs> This guy doesn't break out right now. Thank you. Uh, we don't need to buy anything from him. Blue, red, white, purple. Blue, red, white, purple. <laughs> I'm just gonna keep repeating it. Cannot cancel? Cannot cancel! Cannot cancel. Okay. I never noticed that. Wait, has that always been that way? Okay, once Bull Jr. gets off, we'll send him into this one. Blue, red. It's like those colors where it says a word and then it's in a different color. So it says like red, but the text is blue. And then they're like, what color is this text? And then you have to say blue. And then it's like, what does the word say? Red. Blackout. Enchanted targets receive less damage after a certain amount of time had passed. Those targets made their way to where Big Bird was and died from its attack. Okay. So when it escapes, there's a blackout. When there is a blackout, it makes people come and insta-die. Alright, I don't really know how we are supposed to deal with that. It, wait, it was blue, red, white, purple. So you just can't cancel any work now. Blue, red, white, purple. We have a noon ordeal coming up. It's the skin one. That's going to be kind of an issue. <laughs> Because if they come down here, 
we will be kind of screwed. We don't want them breaking either of these guys out. Honestly, actually, Porcubus can break out. That doesn't really matter. The other ones suck, though. Okay. So, everyone on the map, get in the elevator. Will you finally praise me? I just want to feel proud. The sound of it struggling, as if to say it can't fall asleep like this. Okay, thank you. Who's this? Malka? Yeah. Thanks, Malka. <laughs> Much appreciated. Uh, so we have everyone evacuated except these guys. Uh, let's send these two into a separate zone because they are the dangerous ones. <sighs> Alright, let's... Oh fuck, I forgot. Purple was the last one. Go Vincent V. It better just be the one. Okay, it looks like it is. Let's send these guys down here. And it's just a hay, so hopefully... Hopefully we can uh, take care of this without any issues. Go! Destroy the hay! Nice! Okay, now where are the little guys gonna show up? Okay. You. Your department go. You guys. You guys go. Uh, this one. Summer in Realism. And... Bulk Jr. And it's just those three, right? So we are set. Beautiful. Uh, stop that. Stop that, please. Uh-oh. <laughs> he got away. Okay, you... You guys go kill. Kill him. Don't let the Scarecrow break free. Nice. Ooh, okay. So now we have a 10 meltdown coming up. But we need to figure out what everything does again, though. So. Let's let Vincent V rest a little bit. Wait, I need to, like, call everyone back, don't I? They're all just going back to the elevator. Okay. We're almost there. I hope this isn't some crazy, like, fucked, super difficult thing coming up. Malkuth, you better behave yourself! Otherwise, I will not forgive you. Okay, Anthony. So, insight is still insight. Watch nothing be shuffled. Nope, fortitude is repression. And... That means one of these is Fortitude, and one of them is Temperance. So... Oh, sh shit! Vincent V got the horns. Okay. So, Fortitude is Repression. Repression is Temperance. So it's blue, white, red, purple. Blue, white, red, purple. Blue, white, red, blue, blue, white, red, blue, white, red, purple, okay. Why? we have like a down arrow on the boxes still. Is that just a visual bug? Blue, white, red, purple. Blue, white, red, purple. B, W, R, P. Warp. Uh oh. Uh, so where did he go? Where did he go? Let me put that on normal speed. Oh, he hasn't gone anywhere yet. Um... I think you guys should get in this elevator. In fact, all of you get in the elevator. You guys get in this elevator. 
Where's he going? I swear, if he appears right here, I'm going to scream. Okay. <laughs> Thankfully, he went to the department where there's nobody. <laughs> so, we'll wait for him to relocate again. Now, you guys should also come up to this elevator. Burp. Okay, we're going to speed this up. So we can't really do anything about that right now because this is a one-way hallway. So we would just go in this side and get you. Or is everyone in a safe location? Everyone except Sin. <laughs> okay, where's he warping to? Here? Okay. Everyone? To this elevator? Everyone currently in this elevator? Attack. See, I like this guy because he is straightforward to deal with. Nope, you do not go that way. Go this way. There's nothing else escaping, right? It's just this guy. Oh wait, I can't even end the day if I wanted to. Okay, where did he go? Where is he? Oh, up here. Oh, that's fucking ideal. Okay, go here now. Everyone, get him. Nice. Okay. God, we're gonna have to do another one of these day 23. <laughs> Yikes. Give me your info. Enchanted employees were free from their trance as soon as they were out of the department that suffered from the blackout. Okay. But if they're in a trance... So I just have to get them out? So how do we fight this guy? Also, he only has one outfit. But it does have very high resistances. And the weapon is okay. It's not great, but it's not bad. Okay, everyone's back in your departments, right? Now, it was Burt. That was the mnemonic. Burp. Blue, white, red. Blue. Okay, now we'll have two melt- not two, ten meltdowns coming up. Burp. <laughs> Let me drink some water. Yeah, boy, is so sweaty. Debating if I should take a shower or just wait, because I'm working in tomorrow anyway. <laughs> uh, now that I think about it, that's a really dumb thing to debate. <laughs> it's like, oh, I have work tomorrow, so maybe I shouldn't shower? <laughs> Because I want to be sweaty for work. Burp. So burp means Matt goes here. Please do a good job. Um. Ah, uh, so I couldn't do it. Where did Where did you go? Oh, it ended. It just ended itself. Holy shit! We did it. Proving your competence cleared, and suppress the core of Malkuth cleared. No way. <laughs> what? <laughs> Good job. It just ended. <laughs> you beat it? That was it? Okay, so Pocky got, like, a little bit of SP. Neville at that max temperance. Mac at that max fortitude. Now has five in every stat. Uh, yes. Anthony got some good stat bonuses. Also has a 5 in every stat. Bulb Jr. got a little bit of Temperance. Vincent V upgraded Temperance once you hit Core Suppression for the next one. Yeah, I'll check what the gimmick is next time. <laughs> wow. You can read below Core Suppression to see what they do. Okay. I missed that somehow. I don't think we want nothing there, do we? Or do we? I kinda... 
kind of do want nothing there. Then we can get the weapon. From Break and Ruin, the most beautiful performance begins. I kind of want nothing there. But then we don't get anything. Yeah, well, we don't have nothing there's weapon. We don't have his weapon, but then we don't get armor. And maybe we want armor. Okay, I'll get him. <laughs> and then... Let us meet again as stars. Don't look away, just keep your eyes on it. Contain it in your sight. Okay, well, I better not regret getting new. <laughs> Let us meet again as stars. I hope I don't regret this. Hello, hey, sir! I'm really, really glad to join this team! I forgot to introduce myself. My name is... I'll try my best to be helpful to the team. What, isn't her name Elijah? Why did it bleep it? My name is Beep! Oh, I was writing a report. Where'd it get off to? Nothing could be achieved through passion alone. It was obvious what mistakes and patience could cause, so we needed to take our time. The situation wasn't bright enough for me to remember everyone's name or personally respond to meaningless gestures. It was only after a very long time that I realized giving praise once in a while may have been a good idea. Uh... Is everything alright? You're so silly. I think you confuse us for humans from time to time. I feel like I had a real dream for the first time in a while. The other Sephiroth told me that I damaged the facility a lot. Have you ever felt it, manager? That feeling of sailing the ocean without a map or any kind of guidance. The feeling of groping blindly through a vast darkness. It feels like I'm an island on that vast ocean. I work in the control team. Nobody knows how much pressure it is to be in a position to command everyone else until they've truly tried it themselves. I'm sure you know how it feels, manager. Everything starts tumbling down on top of you when you start thinking you might not be able to handle it. Have you ever looked into the eyes of a dying employee? No? <laughs> I mean, I try not to let my employees die in the first place. Don't look away from them saying that there's nothing you can do for them. Don't just be sorry for the dying sacrifices. Don't blame yourself thinking that you could have done better. Only after can you can confront those memories as they are. Will you be able to see other things? I saw you overcome unavoidable trials, those of which probably originated from me. To be honest, I wasn't sure you would make it. Am I being too forward? We can't change the past, I know. I don't expect you to be a shining beacon or a lighthouse in the vast ocean, or that this place will suddenly become all peaceful and warm. But... Maybe we can just try and wait, right? We'll take in all those horrible moments. Though I want you to be the one to bear the suffering, manager. Like we are now. Uh-oh. The will to stand up straight. Germination of the seed of light. Okay. We're germinating the seed of light. Yes, I never expected them to be restored, but it appears I was wrong this time. I attempted to tell you that it was reckless, however, it wasn't such a big loss on our end. I realized that a large quantity of energy was refined during the process of restoring that Sephiroth. If you wish to know why such an occurrence passed, well, the day will come when you find out. Okay. Wait, this is just day 22, or day 23, right? Yeah. Numerous stories, fertile world, despair and hope. Countless things change in the blink of the eye. All of the wings that keep this world aloft hold at least one singularity. This technology has had the intention to create a fertile world. People wanted a better world. And that aim for a better world set forth new spectacles of shimmer. A previously unimaginable sight that burst forth to the unprepared mind. How you like her robot form? It's kind of square and blocky. Minecraft vibes. Whether or not all that made everyone's life truly fertile is a question we simply won't know the answer to. One thing is certain, it is what enabled me to speak with you now. She's kind of cuboid. 
I don't know. I think I like her, uh, her like holographic human form better. That's just me though. Malkuth synchronization completed. There she is. Control team research. Higher lob payout for each completed workday. Oh shit. All employees have a higher movement speed. The department in which the suppression took place will no longer be influenced by Klefoth meltdowns. Wait, that's busted. That's amazing. So this department is meltdown proof now? For each one? That's so good. Wait, that's so good. Holy shit. Oh, but did these guys lose their continued service benefits? They did. Oh, I'm so upset about that. Okay. Well, I guess we should do Yasad next. And also, if these guys lose continued service, uh, an error with the information and camera systems is detected. Okay. Wait, I want to see what the other one does. Read the thing? That's the thing, isn't it? An error with our employees' statuses is detected. Okay, so I'm assuming for this one I can't see how much health they have. Okay, so for this one, obviously don't tell me what it's going to do, but an error with the information in camera... Is it just going to like fucking lie to me about what's going on? It better not. Like what, it's going to not tell me how my employees are doing with their work or some shit? I'm gonna like have to guess what the results are. I don't know. No, it doesn't. Okay. Well, don't actually tell me. <laughs> I'll figure it out. Um, Vincent V. Summer Realism. So we'll send them into other departments. Realism, go here. Um, yeah, we'll just. Oh wait, we need more people for this department. Okay, Bulk Junior. It's my favorite? Uh-oh. For some reason, that doesn't fill me with confidence. I don't want Yumi. I don't want Maritza. Dr. No? We'll take Dr. No. The reincarnated Dr. No. And then... We should hire someone else for this department. Hunter? No. JJ? No. Finn? Sure. There we go. And they need clothes. So, Waz. We have the green stems now. I'll just pass these to these guys. Uh, and you know, we can pass... Where were you? Who lost their weapon? Neville? Neville will get a green stem. Okay, Doctor No, you need armor. Take Gaze. And then Finn. Fucking goofy suit. Sure, Finn, take the goofy suit. Old Junior, Doctor No, Isabel. Okay, Isabel hasn't been doing any work, so she's gonna need some training. All Asia Sephiroth must have undergone core suppression for me to suppress Tifereth's core, but I need to suppress Hod's core to unlock this dude's core. But we're suppressing the Assad's core right now. So let's do that one. Alright. Here we go. <laughs> no. It's not okay. So it's not just gonna keep fucking putting things in my eyes, right? He's cool looking. See, why do they look like boxes and not this? I would way rather they look like this. That's way cooler. Okay, so something's gonna fucking lie to me, I'm guessing. Oh. <laughs> so I just can't read. I just... No! I just can't read anything. <laughs> it's just fucking... Oh my god. They just deep fried the entire game. I can read this at least. They deep fried the whole last game. 
so I can't like read how they're gonna do. I just have to. Oh. Okay, and we got. What is that? Ew. Love legs. I just. I can't read anything. <laughs> it ruined your camera. Yeah, it did. What the fuck? So I can't even tell what stats these guys have. We're gonna have to fully operate off of our memory. It did. Well, like, it's not lying to me. But it's like. <laughs> really annoying <laughs> but this department's immune to meltdowns now so that's nice holy shit this is awful this is terrible uh let's send you <laughs> i kind of like it though i kind of like in the top right the pixel art dudes it's kind of fun okay so we need to send Sim here. Let's do this one. And send you here and hope it does okay. So maybe we don't work with these guys. Or like, well we have to, right? But I'm not gonna be able to read their conditions. And I can't even tell, okay, 30 for that info? That means this is an ALF, isn't it? They're both ALFs. Why did I take two ALFs? <laughs> I should have just taken nothing there. <laughs> When's the last memory repository? Day 21? Okay. Worst case, we go back to day 21. Want to know? No. I don't want to know. <laughs> what is he saying? This impenetrable darkness something something. At least I can see how this is doing. Nothing will happen if you don't touch them. Okay. Impenetrable darkness is inexplicably lonely. What are you, a fucking novelist? Okay, don't break out. Please, thanks. I can't even see the meltdown bar. Okay, he didn't break out. Wait, why am I getting a... Oh! <laughs> okay, this is extremely inconvenient. Everyone, get in the elevator. We have to deal with this guy. Where is he? Okay. Wait, what? Why did this guy escape? He did not release these guys, did he? No, okay, it's just because we did a shit job here. Um, so let's take this one at a time. Everyone get in there. Oh, there he is. You two... Wait, no. So Sin... Everyone get in this elevator. No, they're gonna have to pass by that guy. So get in this elevator, except for Sin, you get in that elevator. We're just playing on ultra hard mode right now. <laughs> hey, where's this guy going? There. Okay. Everyone? Suppress. Nah. <laughs> no? How much health does this thing have? I can't see it. I can't see how much health it has. Run, 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 run! Cool. Pod is hard mode? Oh no. Where's Mouthman? He is just killing everything. Yikes. Well, that makes me confident. <laughs> Watch him come here now? No, okay. Where did he go? Down here? He's facing that way, though. So I can't do anything about that. So let's just wait for this guy to move. So I can't even see his HP. Where is he? There he is. 
Okay, all of you guys. We're not gonna make it in time. So you know what? All of you guys, stay here. We're just gonna lose that area too, I guess. Holy shit! <laughs> Okay, let's stop working with King Midas over here. Okay, this is good though. So now we know everyone go this way. And of course we've got that movement speed debuff. And now, go get him. I can't see his max HP, damn it. Okay, where's he going? Where did he go? Oh, up there. And he's facing that way again, damn it! Everyone just chill with the Assad in this room. We're all being chillin' with the boy, the homeboy Assad. Can you move? Okay. Where'd you go? Down there. We can make it there in time, right? Hopefully. Probably not, actually, looking at the speed these guys are moving at. Yeah, no, that ain't happening. Holy shit. Where did it go? Oh, here. Okay. Get him. Oh, and of course he's in the fucking slow motion room. And of course you guys have to walk all the way down there. <laughs> oh my god, they're not even gonna make it in time. Yeah, blast him with your magical girl bolts. Wow, okay. And uh, now, he's up here. That one we can make it to. We're gonna lose every area right now. <laughs> every single fucking hallway is gonna get covered in vines. I wonder if it would be better to just... ...restart the day here. What did that guy even work to? Is it done? There's no way he's done. Oh, it's up here, of course. Okay. So, all you guys... Deal with that, please. <laughs> At least they have range. Nice! Okay. <laughs> he was so close to death. But we couldn't tell! Everyone get in there. Everyone get in there. Where is this guy? We are making zero progress. We haven't even gotten one meltdown yet. Because <laughs> somehow everyone decided to fucking escape immediately. Right out the gate. Even though we only got that minus 4%. Absolute shit show. Please go to a room that has another side. Thank you. Get him. Uh oh, someone just got shredded. No! No! Okay. Now go here. Yeah, this isn't hard mode, it's just annoying mode. Please don't go kill yourself. Speaking of, did anyone kill themselves? No. Okay, cool. Please go up here. <laughs> you go here. Please just kill him already. Oh my god, you're not gonna make it in time. 
because of the vines. Are you serious right now? The bullets didn't even reach him in time. And now he's over here! Oh, but he's facing that way. Okay. Hey, everyone. Why don't you go down here? <laughs> I'm losing my mind here. What did we do wrong? What did you do wrong? Oh, shit. Oh, he escaped because... No! Because we had a bunch of deaths. Uh-oh. Go kill him, please. Will we live? Are we living? Nope, someone died. So... I think someone definitely died here. Yep. It was... You. Whatever your name was. Is it worth it to restart? I think we should. <laughs> I think we should restart. That was fucking dumb. Maybe we even go back to the memory repo. You do you. <laughs> I am doing me. Alright, yeah, it was Summer that died. That was so fucking annoying. Oh my god, I, like, miss just being able to read. I want to, like, savor this moment. <laughs> I want to savor this time where I can actually see what's happening on the screen. Alright, we did get two Alephs. I kind of want to get the Aleph info before we repo. Um, so I might try to do that. Information and camera systems, okay. So yeah, I mean, it is descriptive, but you don't know what you're getting into until you start the course of Russian. So now let's repeat the same exact mistake here. <laughs> uh, you go here, wait no, let's send Vincent V here. Um... What is that number? That's 106, isn't it? <laughs> okay, you. Send him in. You don't send anyone. We already made that mistake once. Try repression work with you again. Okay, nobody have a meltdown now, please. The Assad. Why? Why are you like this? You're fine, right? Yeah, you're fine. Don't worry about it. Okay, so this one's 14, but we need 30. I want to try this one next. I cannot see any information. <laughs> uh, you. His eyes look so swollen. <laughs> oh god. Uh, don't send anyone here. Let's send Vincent V here again. Let's send you here. Let's get that meltdown. Uh oh. What did that do? Did it make it even harder to see? No! I'm gonna be completely fucking blind by the end of this. It's just gonna be one giant pixel. It's just, it'll be like one like big gray square. You can't, no. I can't even tell who's doing work anymore. Unless I zoom in super close, it gets harder and no! <laughs> I'm not even gonna be able to tell, like, okay, I guess I think I'm gonna be able to tell when we're getting a, a noon ordeal. Fuck, I don't remember what kind of work these guys like. Wait, I can still tell high and common apart, at least. Um... Common? No, we need the bulk to go. But he's kinda occupied right now. Do we have anyone else? Mac. Okay, you have to do it. 
This is terrible. <laughs> it's so bad. Um, <laughs> it's funny until it's like you have to play it, <laughs> and then it sucks. Holy shit! Can you guys run like faster? Nine seconds. Go, go, get your ass in that room. Okay. How about you? How are you doing? I can't tell. I can't tell. It's funny to watch someone suffer. <laughs> I mean, valid. Alright, Bulg. So I can't even see my own HP. This is hard mode. <laughs> you lied to me. Minus 4%. Alright, go again. This is terrible. <laughs> I can't tell what that's 20? It looks like 20. This is so fucked. <laughs> go, Vincent V. It's not. Trust me. <laughs> no. <laughs> this isn't what I signed up for. <laughs> What? See, like, when the fuck did they die? Hot is a bitch, green is ass. <laughs> Wait, green is net sock, right? When did you die? Who killed you? And why? Who did you even go to work with? <laughs> I can't check. <laughs> I can't check who killed them. That's a good result. Okay, that's an A left. <laughs> My balls killed him, what? <laughs> Excuse me? <laughs> In what capacity? Hang on, let's send Summer here. We might as well start doing the easy guys now. <laughs> they look so tired. Okay. The feet might have swallowed him. I don't have feet. They're- oh, these feet? No, I didn't send him to the feet. Unless they can swallow anyone. Unless the feet just swallow people willy-nilly. I don't know, we'll figure that out. <laughs> don't give me too much foot info. They swallow people? Okay. <laughs> Okay, so I won't work with them. Uh... <laughs> These both seem pretty bad right now. Minus 6%, minus 6%. The Bulg's Zootopia- Oh, you saw that shit? <laughs> the fucking- Y'all saw the, the Resident Evil fucking Zootopia porn clip? <laughs> Why is that a thing? Why is that in the show? Like, I just saw it on- I, I saw it browsing social media. And then I I found it on YouTube. Because I was like, there's no way this is real. So I searched Resident Evil Zootopia line. Because there was no way I was putting the fucking word porn in my Google search. Because you just know it would have just shown me, like, Judy Hopps with her ass out. So, I, uh, I searched that shit. And of course the first result is YouTube. Zootopia, like that line from the show. Why? It was like delivered so poorly too. It was just such a like a bad line. Oh! The fucking- that's what happened. Cause we didn't have Temperance 4. I forgot, if you send someone with lower than Temperance 4 to work with Porticolis or whatever he's called, he explodes your head. Um, so that was my bad. <laughs> to be fair, I can't tell who has what temperance right now. Uh, let's send you. And let's trigger that ordeal. Okay. Watch out. Purple? Purple's fine. Purple's no biggie. Uh, what is kind of a biggie is that... I cannot send Sin, because he'll just kill everyone. Unless I send only Sin. 
Alright, go. I'm not sending Sin. This guy's about to escape. <laughs> go, come on, Pocky. I can't tell what the fuck is happening. Can you not? Why are we doing no damage to it? Oh, because we're doing black damage? Wait, both of these guys are black damage. So, the plant's gonna escape. Yeah. The plant is gonna escape. No, wait, we saved it. Thank God. <laughs> we do have one death, but you know, <laughs> I think getting through this with one death is perfectly viable. So, let's... I don't know. Send Mac again, I guess. Send you here. Send you here. And you here. And... You here. <laughs> Wait, it didn't get worse. That one didn't do anything. That's another fucking ordeal, though. We have a noon ordeal coming up immediately. Piping hot noontime ordeal. I kind of want to get this guy's name, at least, so that I can not pick him again. So the feet swallow people, you said. We'll be fine. <laughs> we'll be fine. Who's gonna get swallowed? I'll keep an eye on them, though. So we're almost at capacity. So that's a plus. I don't remember what the green nor 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 deal is, though. Hello? Oh, you're fine. Give me the suit. Oh shit, I actually afforded it. Okay, I can't read any of this. <laughs> Why did I buy it? <laughs> Why did I buy that info? Cause like, even if we reset day or rewind to repo, either way, <laughs> we're not gonna like be able to read it unless we unlock all of his info. Alright, go Pocky. Uh oh. The feet don't like to be repressed. They like to roam free. Hashtag free the foot. I am so sick of not being able to take off my shoes and socks in public! Free the foot! I want to let my little piggies roam free. Okay, so you're called Rager, <laughs> and it is a uh, fucking danger level. <laughs> um, so we should evacuate everyone. Oh, I can't even tell who's uh, who's the crazy guy now. Okay, let's start by getting everyone on this floor into this elevator. We have a green ordeal coming up. Now. Let's get everyone from this floor also into that, except you. You stand in this elevator. <laughs> we don't want you in our elevator. <laughs> because you have a gun and you shoot literally everyone with it. It's nothing personal. Okay. Wait, what was the person who died even holding? Can I check that? You had... Okay, this weapon. Can't afford it. And this outfit. That one we afforded. You! Can't afford the hammer. Did I get the name of this? Skin Prophecy. Yeah. Okay, so maybe we do do a memory repo, but first I'm gonna see how far we can get. And hopefully none of our people with Aleph level gear dies. Because if they do, I will be very upset. 
Oh, steady spaghetti. Minus 8%. That is a pretty big minus percent. So let's do a Poe Day. Quick 360 Poe Day move. Oh no! <laughs> no. What the fuck is this? No, it's hyper saturated. <laughs> this is terrible. I feel like I'm underwater. If I had all my lights off, I would be getting sick right now. I can't even find the fucking noon ordeal. Where is it? You? Oh, it's these guys. Uh-oh. Okay, where's the one in this department? There you are. Wait, you don't go. Uh... Get the fuck out of there, dude. Okay, now get him. Okay, that's one. I can't check HP. <laughs> so everyone, get in this room. So that you can at least heal. Why are you guys in here? Holy shit. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why? Why did it have to be like this? Oh, I didn't even send the top people to the last one. Alright, please. Wipe this dude out. That was hella fast. Okay, next. Is there one in this department? I don't see one in this department. I think maybe it didn't get one. Come on, wipe him out. Nice. Next. Next, let's chill here for a second. Oh wait, but if too many people die, this guy's gonna go fucking bonkers. Uh, you. Please work with it, real quick. Um, you guys. Save everyone's ass. Okay, and now last one. Now, as long as Crazy Shotgun Dude is not mixed in with all the other dudes. He is. <laughs> he is. <laughs> Thank God. Okay. Now, everyone back to your departments. Whew, I don't want a Dusk Ordeal to happen. I cannot handle that. No one's dead, right? Except you. <laughs> Except the one with the exploded head. Yeah, no, but we were already aware of that. Okay. You. Uh... You. I kind of don't want to send you here. I'll send you here, though, I guess? This one. Should we get more info? What if we just unlocked all the info? I feel like he's been almost harmless so far, and I hope saying that doesn't jinx everything and make me regret my life. But, we'll see. We will find out and we will suffer for our mistakes. Blue... Stap. Blue Stap. And the Silent Orchestra. Oh, fuck. Nope, not you. I'll send you. You best do good, though. Otherwise, I'm gonna send you to work with Blue Stap. You're gonna get a Stap infection. Wow, good result. Can't afford that info, though. Uh-oh. So...
I think this is a great time <laughs> to rewind to the memory repository. <laughs> I 100% jinxed it. Um, should we see what happens? It's an Alef though. So you know it's gonna be bad. I want a repo. I'm going to the repo. Yeah. Wait, before I do that, I want to make sure we bought everything we can buy. So please don't do that. It's hard enough to see it as is. I can't see anything. Because <laughs> this fucker here. <laughs> he had to put his curtains right in front of my eyes. Okay, nothing, right? Yeah, nothing we want. Okay. Memory repo. Make my life easier. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> so, uh, I think that means sin is gonna no longer exist. I don't remember the numbers in his name, so we'll have to wait for him to come back um, before we create him. Which means congratulations, Cloud, you are the new hire. Three, six, two. Since your name is pink for me, I'm gonna give you pink hair. Cause that's how it be. <laughs> uh, how do I get to pink? Isn't it like... So that's red. Pink is white and red, so shouldn't... <laughs> shouldn't that be pink? Or is like... Is that... Okay, more blue, slightly less blue, no green, some blue. Yeah, we need max red. That might be the pinkest I can make it. Okay. Hair. Let's figure out some jammed cloud hair. <laughs> that one. And you have twin tails, right? You have like braids going down. <laughs> we will give you... These eyes. <laughs> Those brows. Not too shit-eating, but maybe a little shit-eating. Or that. That one's just depression. But, uh, I don't know. <laughs> That's a good combat face. I like that one. I like when they, uh, when they look like they don't really want to fight, but then they're secretly a badass. That's gonna be you. And then we'll give you these eyes. With those brows, and then dead face. That's a good dead face. Okay. We will give you three, three. We have to give you a four in temperance. Uh, and that is 17 lob. Okay. There you are. Yeah, so we, <laughs> we were four boxes away from being able to... Or six boxes, rather. Okay, that one just don't suck. This one... Yes, so we have to send Temperance 4 or higher to work with uh, Porcubus. This should be easy, though. Oh, we have to be past day 22 to do a course suppression, though. Shit. Uh, well, that's fine. We'll just finish up day 21 pretty quick. And then we can do a course suppression. So, Bulb Jr., you're getting transferred here. Oh, and then Vincent V. We need you. You no longer exist. Vincent V. 222. I don't remember what you looked like either. You had some kind of purple hair. This time I think we're gonna go gray for you. Like that. 
Uh, and then... <clears throat> I kind of want to make you bald. <laughs> you don't mind, right? 40? Is 40 the only bald one? Why are there two different bald haircuts? I'm guessing one belongs to some NPC. So that they have like a unique bald. What if we give you the worst fucking hairline in human history? <laughs> Dude. I kind of want to do it. The fucking bald mullet, dude? Or this one. I like that, though. Worst mullet in human history. <laughs> Can I give you no eyebrows, too? There's no option for no eyebrows. I hate this. <laughs> I'm sorry, I gave you a terrible face. <laughs> Holy shit. Holy shit, I hate it. I hate it with every fiber of my being. And then the confident dead face. Okay. <laughs> I hate it, dude. I hate it so much my voice is cracking. Alright, I guess Summer's the boss now, right? You're back? Oh, hey, Jam Cloud. I made you. That's what you look like, right? We, uh, we did a memory repo. Yes. Meme. Meme restart. Uh, this <laughs> What a fucking Chad! What a Chad! Look at him! He's just wearing that. <laughs> He's so confident with it. All right, we have to give someone lamp. Who desires the lamp? You can have green stem. Maybe we give uh. Mac the lamp. Lamp. For every creature it saved, Big Bird's eyes gain another in number. The radiant pride is apparent on the armor. Dozens of blazing eyes always stare into one spot. Okay. So now it's lamp and cheesy. I like that. Neville needs a weapon. Let's give him something shitty. Like that. Uh, let's make sure we don't have too much black damage. Vincent V needs something. Nope, nobody should have the magic bullet. Never again. <laughs> Never again. And then, Cloud, you need a weapon. We don't really have any good weapons, so unfortunately, <laughs> uh, you're gonna have the Harmony. At least Bull Jr. keeps the fucking awesome fist. Alright, weave, you, 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 wah, 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 wee, wah. Key. Do we have any other wall armor? We have another score. Let's put that on Anthony. Perfect. Now everyone's wearing wall armor? Or higher? That's amazing. I almost want to take a screenshot, because Vincent V looks so good here. It's the best he's ever looked. And you're pretty cool too, Cloud. <laughs> I like the pigtails. You're rocking them. Got a lot of confidence. Unfortunately, we cannot jump straight into a core suppression because apparently uh, we have to get to day 22 to do that. Oh shit. Wait, my boss tried to call me. Uh, wait, give me one second. I'll be right back. <laughs>
Okay, I'm back. <laughs> I fucking called my boss real quick while I'm in the middle of streaming. <laughs> no, he just called because um, there's like a some schedule stuff coming out for next month, I think. Uh, so he wanted to let me know about that. It was hella awkward. <laughs> anyway, uh, all my people wearing Aleph armor. Oh shit. That's goals. I don't have enough Alephs. <laughs> Every time we get an Aleph, I reroll, so uh, it might be a little while. So, hang on. I do want to get some Alephs and like actually keep them for once. Giga Chads. Yes. I want some Giga Chads, but like, not yet. <laughs> I'm not ready yet. Maybe once we've done a couple core suppressions. Oh, but they're just gonna keep coming, aren't they? Fuck me, dude. Okay. Well, we might as well just start now. I had to restart back to day one because I missed a core suppression. Oh shit. You have to fully restart? I guess it's like... the completion, right? That sucks, though. Well, but like, okay, my assumption is if you do all the core su suppressions, it's a unique ending, right? Once you day get to day 46, you do. So, like, there's... There's multiple endings, right? There's like three different endings that I saw. Um, so yeah, if you, you get a special ending if you do all the cores, and then you get an ending if you don't do all of them, right? I heard you can't finish the game. Wait, what? If you, like, don't do all the core shit? Oh, Mac is in desperate need of some stats here. Anthony, work on that. You googled it? Uh, Cloud, go work on Instinct. Bulk Jr. already got the max stats. Okay, this is gonna be like a light work day, I think. I can tell you how to get each ending, but it might spoil day- f Yeah, don't tell me. <laughs> That's not what I was asking. Yeah, I was just confirming. Um, yeah, just my assumption was that you have to do all the core suppressions to get, like, the true ending or something. But we will cross that bridge when we come to it. But having to, like... No, just don't tell me at all, it's fine. <laughs> I don't need to know. <laughs> no. <laughs> Uh, wait, so we also get to keep the suppression, though. So that's amazing, because this will never melt down, uh, except the old lady is kind of just melting herself down. But that means we will never have to go in the old lady's room ever again. So that is kind of great. That is kind of dope. Kind of awesome. Even after you fully restart, that's so good. As long as you don't wipe the data, right? <laughs> right now I get zero meltdowns, that's so good. Oh wait, so did you just restart the game, like, now? As long as you don't wipe the save, yeah. I did, um, so I have technically played this game before, like, two or three years ago. And I wiped my save, uh, in order to stream it. You're at about day- oh, you're at day 15, okay. Good luck. I wonder if you're gonna finish before I do. Probably, because I bet you have, like, a ton of info and Aleph level armor and stuff. You better not escape. You better fucking not. Thank you. Nice. So are you just speed running? <laughs> Go, cloud.
All right. Thankfully, most of our cool accessories are like uh, saved behind the memory repo. So as long as we just keep hitting repository, we won't lose all of our valuable stuff. And honestly, like the point we're at so far, we can like totally work with what we have right now. All of this stuff is definitely workable. This guy's annoying, but we can work with it, especially once we get more Aleph gear. So we have a Dawn Ordeal coming up. Let's do these two right now. Uh, yeah, so, oh, what I was saying, so the first time I, like, played the game, I think I made it to, like, day 20-something. That was as far as I got. So that's why I have, like, a vague memory of some of these characters. Some of these, uh, abnormalities, I mean. Okay, who should we send here? You. Go, Neville. Okay. Fruit time. Come on, destroy the fruit. I hate that it... Wait, it doesn't even resist black damage. Why were we doing no damage? Did we just have a really shit character? See, like, they melted it. Dude, I want to make hard progress now. Like, <laughs> we have been reliving the same couple days for over a week, I think. And I desire progress. I need it. Oh, speaking of, Vincent V, <laughs> go put that bald head of yours to work. Look at him. I just, I never get over it. I, it doesn't get old. It's so fucking goofy. Okay. We could finish the workday here. We don't really have any reason to keep grinding. Unless we want levels. I kind of want levels. I don't know. Um, I kind of want to just grind Vincent V, actually. Not in a weird way. <laughs> Don't take that out of context. <laughs> Porcubus. He porks and he ubises. And brooch. Engulfing green, solitude. I'll keep sending you to Cloud. Bim, bom, bom, bim, bom. I mean, honestly, we don't benefit that much from this no longer melting down because this guy is a fucking pushover. He's piss easy. Um, the rest we can literally ignore and it doesn't matter. And all that does is it means our scarier guys have a higher chance of melting down. So now that I'm thinking about it... Wait, <laughs> he got the horns on his first try? What a god. What a god among men. So we have a noon ordeal coming up. See, like, what did I say? Mac, you go here. Anthony, you go here. I'm gonna make you immediately get out of there. Okay, get the fuck out. Get the fuck out. I'm gonna close my curtain because it's getting dark. I fucking called my boss. Honestly, I thought he left a voicemail. So I clicked like the, the missed call to check the voicemail. But it turned out he just called and didn't leave a voicemail, so I ended up calling him back. And then I was like, well, shit, I guess I'm doing this. Because it was already ringing. 
Okay, I guess I'm calling my boss at... What time is it? Almost 9 p.m.? God, I hope he wasn't, like, eating dinner or something. Well, no, nobody eats dinner this late except me, I think. No one's that messed up. Cloud, I want you to get this accessory. Start accessorizing. Okay, we'll end once this last work finishes. Once Cloud finishes up. And there we go. That's everything? It is. Okay, workday done. Uh, 100 fortitude. Mac needs temperance. Nare got good fortitude. Anthony. Wow. Both stats went to 5. Or wait, no. This one just has a debuff on it that was dropping it to 4. Um, still good though. 5 fortitude on Cloud. And a little bit more temperance on Vincent V. Why does their cloth do that? <laughs> Why is it like that? Yikes. Well, now we have to pick some. Hopefully we pick right. The red shoes, the funeral of the dead butterflies. I guess we, like, they keep fucking dangling this one in front of us. The prayer shall inevitably live with the eternal despair of his worship. Have you sit hit absolute rock bottom? Honestly, maybe we take the backward clock here. Just so that we don't have, like, a dog shit item. Because this one, at least we can ignore. But maybe we take this and see what it does. Alright, I got a letter from the boss. No, just call me, dude. Why are you sending letters? Bruh, also, when I just, when I was on the phone, I just went like, okay, bye. <laughs> and I wasn't like, uh, have a good weekend or any of that shit. I was just like, bye. <laughs> the thorny abnormality that feeds off the gaze of others and sometimes stretches its wings. Why is it always fucking plants? This is just plant zone. It's all plants. What is this? It's a time-based one. Those ones are more annoying. Okay, so I think what we do here, we start by just collecting info, restart the day, once we know what these guys do, then we do the meltdown, not the meltdown, the core suppression, I need to pee. I pressed the wrong button. <laughs> I'm back. Let's 
hire someone who isn't Georgia, or Griffin, or Shao, or Reno, or Xavier, or Ara, or Maki, or let's hire Piper. Don't give her 4 fortitude though. Don't give her 4 justice either, holy shit. Welcome back, thank you. <laughs> Go Piper. She's gonna get pied at the next, uh, they don't do that at work, dude, like at workplaces. So in school, I remember that there used to be that shit where you could donate, and if you donated enough, teachers would get pied, and you could like pick which teacher you want to pie when you donate. I don't think they do that in offices though. Yo, Vincent V222, what is up my guy? At your job, <laughs> do they pie people? <laughs> Do they have, like, pie fundraisers? Alright, so, we're doing the strap. We're gonna collect info. Holy jeez. That is not a plant. That is just an eyeball. And we got a notepad. Dude, check out my, uh... Fanfiction on notepad. Is that what it's called? It, or is it wordpad? Or is it wordpress? It's one of those. One or all. Holy shit, you're terrible. Oh, that's why, because we have to watch it. Or no, we have to not watch it. Thank God Bulg Jr. is sturdy. <laughs> Get sturdy, Bulg Jr. Notes from a crazy researcher. The old notes are full of incomprehensible cursive letters and writings. High fish bulge? That's wrong! That's not my name! <laughs> Those who equip notes from a crazed re- <laughs> I'm fucking crazed will benefit from a sharp increase in the stats related to temperance. Don't make me chug my water. You ever just make intense eye contact while eating? Sharp increase- okay. Go crazy. Go stupid. <laughs> so that one sucks. Uh, never take your eyes off it, you said? So this one also kind of sucks, but it sucks mildly less. Or wait, no, this unsucks. <laughs> Who said that? Who said don't take your eyes off it? The fucking the when you pick it up when you pick it up it said don't take your eyes off it It was like stare at it Don't let it out of your sight. That's what it said when I picked up the abnormality They once belonged to a researcher who had gone mad during their work It's only been partially deciphered, but it seems most of it relates to the various experiments that were conducted in this place if ordered to return notes from a crazed researcher within 30 seconds of equipping, their skin will swell and their body will explode. Okay, I am very glad that I held on to that. How crazed are you feeling, Piper? Okay, now let's get some actual info in this bitch. Yeah, look, see? <laughs> Work must be done while the manager has the containment unit in sight! I am reading between the lines. During the work process, when the containment unit went out of the camera's sight, the Cleefoth counter lowered. When it was still unmonitored, unmonitored after the phenomenon, the counter continued to lower. That's why I was confused. Oh, because I already knew. <laughs> yeah, that was actually a very helpful hint that they gave. It's like the opposite of fucking shy spider bot. Don't watch me work. Fucking ah ha ha ha, cover my mouth when I laugh type vibes. When the work result was normal or good, the counter increased. It can be increased up to three levels at a time depending on the work result. Do not stop looking at it while its suppression is in progress. That's all we need. Okay. And now attachment work is common. That is all the info we need. If ordered to return notes without performing any sort of work, the user will explode. I'm glad we still haven't returned it. Holy shit. 
Go do some work then, Piper. Wait, but first I want to see what happens. I want to see if there's any more info we need. That's minus 12% though, so maybe we should start expanding our horizons. Alright, Vincent B. <laughs> Go <laughs> put that fucking bald noggin to work. Uh, Anthony, go here. Mac, go there. Alright, Liddy. Liddy Bobitty. Fee Fi Fo Fitty. I need about tree fitty. Uh, Jam Cloud, go here. What is that from? What is that actually from? It's like South Park or something, isn't it? I only know because I've seen shit posts that quote it. And I remember I googled it one time because I was curious. The final chapter ends with the phrase born again. If they receive a certain amount of damage, they will explode. And the explosion will cover the entire section. Okay. And then it's going to be like if they hold it for 3 minutes and 30 seconds, they die or something. I can't wait. Still hasn't been 30 seconds? Come on. Come on. Let's watch it update in real time. We can't. One's observational skill will improve just by holding this item. However, if it is returned without fulfilling the yearning for knowledge, the incompetent shall explode. Amazing. I love it when the incompetent explodes. Alright, so we should send Piper to work with Porcubus. I feel like she'll do good. So, do we need any other info? That's kind of all we need, isn't it? I also just want to find out what work we should do. And then I think we'll be fine, actually. I think we will be able to do Yasad no problem when we aren't fucking dancing around like a chicken with its head cut off. Um, Piper, go work on attachment. Let's trigger this meltdown already. Yeah, we'll be fine. Uh, you're melting down, and you are melting down. Go, Mac. Mac has no accessories. Uh... I'm gonna send the Bulg, just because he's higher level. So I like this guy. I kind of want to keep this dude. So hopefully we don't get any really shitty Alephs coming up. Beautiful. Okay, an attachment work is the move. Great. So now we can just restart, can't we? There's no point in getting everything else. Alright, now it's meltdown time. Number two, Yasad's meltdown. You don't have to have it zoomed up like that. Yeah, I figured. <laughs> I was just kinda... <laughs> kinda doing that. <laughs> you can keep it in your screen, yeah. I guess I will, uh, not zoom in so much next time. <laughs> Vincent V. Indecisive Hunter. So we need Vincent V to get some, some levels. What do you do? Justice will increase. Prudence will drop. Okay, so let's get Vincent V. Smack that motherfucker on, a. Uh, a behavior adjustment and then send him to work with my guy Der Freischutz so that he can level up his justice. That's perfect. Um, Summer is strong so let's put her here and realism can 
to go there, because whatever. Alright. Let's go. Core suppression. <laughs> Dying cat. You can have them in training team. Which one is training team? They got buffed for leveling up? Huh? I think it's fine as is, but if we do end up having to restart, then I will, uh... Oh, HOD is training team? Okay. I did not realize. Okay, that's cool. Um... So... Let's send you here, so that we don't accidentally kill you. HOD gives extra XP for stats? Oh, I didn't know that. Okay, that's really good. Okay, so then we should have sent them to the training team. I mean, it makes sense. Like, they train better in the training team. Yeah, like... <laughs> but yeah, I didn't realize that. Okay. Okay, go Vincent B. Now, how much is your stat increasing by? I wouldn't risk it just yet. Um... Uh... Bold, go again. So let's send uh, Mac here. You have the buff, right? Please don't die. Each department has a little bonus, like control team extra movement speed, information gives temperance buff. Okay. Like beyond um, the continued service benefit, you mean? The... Hang on, I can read this. The Burrowing Heaven. What a name. Focus camera, please. <laughs> I would if I could. <laughs> it's a little band they carry? Yeah. Either- okay, I thought it only uh, happened if they got continued service. I didn't realize they get it from day one. That's pretty good. Um, Vincent B, go. How's it going, Sin? Unfortunately, we had to memory repo, so you got Thanos snapped, but we will bring you back next time. <laughs> Later on, they become captain. Yes. They buff the team. Oh, shit. Okay. I think the captain just gets a better buff, don't they? Look at all that info we're getting. Alright, go bits and be better be snapped than forgotten. <laughs> True. Yeah, I think usually when you get Thanos snapped, everyone does forget you, right? <laughs> Not this time though. We'll carry on your legacy. Wait, we wanted to not upgrade her temperance or not temperance, instinct. Um because we need her to work with the people shredder. This <laughs> fucking... <laughs> oh my god, it's like I'm playing Risk of Rain or something. <laughs> the OG Risk of Rain. Alright. I'm not gonna be able to tell what's melting down. <laughs> we have a red noon, or not noon, red dawn coming up. I feel like that's a euphemism. Okay, let's send Mac here. And let's send Binsen B here. Holy shit. <laughs> you know, I honestly would vibe with like a pixel art version of Lobotomy Corp though. Like I would probably fuck with that harder than the base game. If they just had like one that was full pixel art. I love pixel art so much. Call the cognition filter company, request immediate service, tell them it's stuck in Minecraft mode. <laughs> Please. Everything is just blocks. <laughs> it's like Notch developed this game. Alright, uh... <laughs> I can't see shit. <laughs> uh, you... Who do we send? We were sending this guy, right? It's such a shame, too. Because, uh, Yasad looks so fucking cool. But we're, like, 
gradually just going blind. We can't even appreciate his cool, like, AI monster tree design. Give me that one. Oh? I can't tell what that is. I can't tell how many of these I can buy. Is that a three or a five or neither? Give me as many of these as I can afford. I guess it was two. <laughs> I'm so glad we did this beforehand. Oh wait, we need to also put this shit back though, once we finish that. Yeah, put that back, right now. I forgot that there's like a damage threshold after which we get fucked. So you hurry and put that back before we trigger the meltdown. Okay, beautiful. Now... You. <laughs> Vincent V looks wicked fucked up. <laughs> Where is this guy? Hello? Where is he? Where is this guy? There's one here. Have they not spawned in yet? No, there he is. That's one. Oh shit. There's no one in this department. So let's send two guys from this department. Um, you send the other two from that department. Is there no one up here? Hang on, so it's one, two, three. I hate that. <laughs> Where is he? There he is! He's just invisible. <laughs> okay, is that all of them? It's just the four? I feel like there should be a fifth one, shouldn't there? Or I guess not, because this one is currently Meltdown. Please give me my music back. Okay, I guess if the People Shredder melts down, it's not that big of a deal. Is it? Yep, okay, no more People Shredder. <laughs> just ignore it if it melts down. Okay, great. I can't tell if this is working. Oh, it's not because it's that room. Holy shit. <laughs> Holy shit. Fucking 2 bit. It's like that meme with the fucking 64 bits, 32 bits, 8 bits, 4 bits, 2 bits, 1 bit. <laughs> Holy shit, if I actually edit a video, which I'd never do, <laughs> but if I actually did, I should add that fucking meme every time this shit happens. That would be legendary. Okay, hang on. And by legendary, I mean mildly amusing. <laughs> you go pick that up again. Um, Everything else is probably set, right? We might as well just work with this dude, too. Go, Bulk. I forget if this one's time-based, or if it's just a buff. We can find out. Honestly, if whatever the fuck their name was loses their head, I don't even remember their name, so... <laughs> we'll be fine. We'll survive. As long as we don't get some fucked up Aleph's. Uh, give me that. Nice! Look at that. Look at that. We can't afford either of them, but we unlocked them and they look nice. <laughs> They're pretty, and that's what matters, I guess. Not really. Go, Vincent V. Once Vincent V gets the crack pipe in his mouth, it's all over. We'll just win by default. I just need him to get that crack pipe. Alright. Where's the intense music? It was so fucking crazy at the beginning, like right when I started Malkuth's core suppression, it was like <laughs> And now we just have the kinda ding 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 music. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna give myself an aneurysm. Get the fucking crack pipe, dude. Oh! That scared me. That <laughs> actually scared me. Who's melting down? Oh, of course you would. 
Let's send Drunpaki. You're melting down, because of course you would. Send this guy. Uh, you're melting down. We're already going to deal with that. This one's melting down. We're going to need to immediately evacuate that shit. This one never melts down. Okay. So the only one that we actually need to remember is this guy. Oh shit, and I have to keep watching him. That was bad timing. <laughs> okay, get out. Too spoopy for me? <laughs> is this spoopy? I just find it fucking maddening. <laughs> like, <laughs> my eyes! Is there like a screen filter I can do? Hang on. Does my monitor have like settings so I can unsaturate this shit? Because this shit is visually rancid. You are unfit to be the man who- Fuck off! <laughs> You're just creating problems! You're unfit to be a fucking... What are you called? A, a Sephiroth. You don't even carry a long sword. <laughs> I'm so topical. Uh, put back the book. Now pick it up again. Good job. Now go work some more. <laughs> you gonna take that shit from a man who wears tactical turtlenecks? <laughs> Never! <laughs> you know, honestly, Tactical turtlenecks might be the the new thing though. That's kind of fucking sick. Can like, first of all, Vincent V looks like he's already been hitting the crack pipe, but he needs it in his mouth. Oh my god! All these guys with the closed eyes look like they've been hitting the crack pipe. I didn't mean to actually send you. You just look like you got fly eyes. Yeah, no, he's a fucking... <laughs> he's a robotic tree that wears turtlenecks. <laughs> what a chad. What an absolute god among men. Or I guess among AI. That was one of Yasad's robotic farts. <laughs> <laughs> so we have a noon ordeal coming up, but it's the easy one. It's the one where as long as we get everyone in the fucking hallway, we'll be fine. Huh? Huh? Are you done? That is an 8, right? <laughs> Please. Please work with me here. We have 1 out of 6? <laughs> Holy shit, I can't read! <laughs> like, worse than usual! You need to heal. What is that? Who's in the hallway? Who is this? You? Why are you in the hallway? Why did it actually break out? Why did it do that? <laughs> I don't remember what his rules were. Go wipe him out. Uh, yeah, get him. I wish I could see that HP bar of his. Nice, Reddit mod broke out. <laughs> Send him back! <laughs> Put him back in the basement! Call his mom. We are calling your mother, sir. She will not like what she hears. Okay, let's send you, and then you return that shit. Wait, how close are we? One more. After this one. This dude is taking his goddamn time. Okay, perfect. So it is soon evacuation o'clock. That was the most <laughs> direct way to phrase that, for sure. <laughs> Oops.
You'll be fine, right? You don't mind. You don't mind a couple, uh... A couple works now and then. A couple normal works. That's minus 12. Ooh, 60 boxes. Is that two out of two? We have 10 boxes now. I am extremely illiterate. Okay. Uh, everyone, to the elevator. This is just my favorite elevator. I don't know why. It's always this elevator that I like. <laughs> I like to cram them all into that one. And now who do we send? Wait, did you return this? No, you need to return that shit. Run! Move those tiny little legs. Because it's stubby. Good job. Okay. Now let's send Vincent V. Because he is desperate for that pipe. I can't wait to not be able to tell where these guys are landing. Okay, there's Vincent V. He made it. Okay. Wait for them to fall. Perfect. Go. That's one that was so fast. <laughs> I'm fast as fuck, boy. Holy shit, it's so fast. Okay, this guy now. I feel like we're taking no damage. Uh, never mind. Someone died. Who died? Or did something break out? What broke out? Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> that was probably one of the worst things that could have happened just now. How am I gonna find it? <laughs> Wait, you guys actually deal with this guy first. That is pretty bad. So where is it? <laughs> um... Um... <laughs> there he is! Okay, you know what, you can just chill there. I will never be going down that hallway. What are you looking for? The fucking tree dude! This guy! <laughs> fucking little Johnny Appleseed broke out. Look, <laughs> that's why I got the the spoopy stuff happening. Because I forgot that when these guys explode, or rather than forgot, I just didn't have any fucking idea that when they explode, everything escapes. <laughs> so now let's select everyone on the map and send them here, I guess. I couldn't tell when it was in the containment because of extreme eye cancer. Oh, word. <laughs> Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> that is perfectly valid. Okay, where the fuck is it though? It's still here. Okay, I'm gonna just watch it, and then we will pause and find this son of a bitch. Okay. There you are. Where are you? Huh? What? Excuse- Oh, what? <laughs> Wait! There's no one there! Okay, maybe we can actually get there fast. Destroy him. Please. Obliterate. Please. Someone went crazy. Uh, everyone? <laughs> get back in here. Uh... Get... So, how many people went crazy and how many people died? You died. Vincent V died. <laughs> Two more deaths. That was a terrible idea. Uh, should I restart? I think I should restart. It's gonna take a lot of money to replace all those guys. Fucking hell. End my life. Now we have to sit through that all again. I'm gonna go put my goddamn glasses on. <laughs>
I need that extra blue light protection or whatever. Also, I'm hungry, so I'm gonna get some food. Uh, BRB. All right, I'm back and my eyes are ready to bleed. I got beverage, um, the remains of my lunch that I didn't finish, which has completely fallen apart. It was supposed to be like a pita sandwich pocket type deal. Um, and instead it is <laughs> wet bread on a fork. Mmm. <laughs> that is some wet bread with dill and feta, which honestly, aside from the bread aspect, is pretty solid. Dill and feta are both things that I enjoy. Um, we gotta smack that motherfucking core suppression button. Hit that fast forward button. And start speed running shit. Where's Binsen B? There he is. Alright. See, this is the shit that I was hoping would play again. Second trumpet slaps? It does. If that's what this is, then it does. <laughs> How did we get second trumpet immediately, though? We're just that good at the game. Dude, I got more trumpets than you can handle. Alright, we are hardcore speedrunning. It is hard to find that button, though. <laughs> When there's nothing here, it's like, oh, uh, where was the <laughs> change panel? Because it's a meltdown, they always start with second trumpet except for two. Oh, okay. 
Yeah, the last one started with Second Trumpet, I think. Um, but then it stopped, and then I didn't notice it for a while. Excuse me. Alright, what's he called? Blorgy? Uh-oh. Uh, so you're melting down. That is less than ideal. And then... Oh! Well, we're already on the way to help that guy. Let me eat some more of my soft bread. Right. You. You. Um. You. You'll be fine. You. Are you fine? Yeah. Okay. Here we go. Here we go! I neglected to mention that this pita also was sitting in my bag all day long <laughs> because I didn't eat it for lunch. And I don't put stuff in the fridge because I'm stupid. So... Well, not- it's more so I don't put stuff in the fridge because I don't want it to be cold if I do end up eating it for lunch. And, like, it's not that big of a deal if it's just in my bag for, like, a couple hours, but then when it's in there for the whole day is when it becomes a little bit of an issue. Um, so yeah. It is, uh, somewhat questionable food material now. Go, Vincent V. He still hasn't picked up the crack pipe. Go. Oh wait, don't go. <laughs> That's an ordeal coming up and I want all hands on deck for that shit. Alright, we're speed running good though. Put this back. Cause I don't want you to explode randomly. And once you put that back, we will send mac and cheese in. I don't remember what the yellow one was. I always forget what this is. Is it one of the- it's probably one of the slug ones, right? Yeah, it's the one with a lot of slugs. Yeah, it's the one with a lot of slugs. Okay. Um... You know what, you guys can handle that. I will send only the bulb to handle this one. You guys handle that. You guys handle this. Oops. And you guys handle this. Let's watch the bulb solo. What the fuck? <laughs> no, you can't just solo one of them and then run away immediately. <laughs> What is wrong with you? All of them. Stay in this room. Until they're all clean. You can't get up until you finish everything on your plate. There. Okay, is that everything? No. What the fuck? Go kill these ones! Why are you just letting them roam free? They killed the one that was the target and then go back to the base like, oh, the rest of them will sort themselves out. And brain damaged employees. Uh, you go here. It's okay, I'm a brain damaged manager, so it all evens out. I want that second trumpet music back. Gimme. Okay, hey, you're good. <laughs> Excuse me. Okay, give me one second. 
Okay. I just wanted to crack this open without fucking loud ass can ASMR. Mmm. Tastes kinda sour. Okay, you'll be fine, right? What's that percent? Four percent? Yeah, you'll be fine. Um you will also be fine. Trust me. Source, trust me, bro. Okay, you go here. Um, that's one, two, three, four. Let's not do the fifth one yet. Just in case that's the meltdown. This one isn't even that hard. Or it shouldn't be that hard. But I feel like now that I'm saying that, we're gonna have a lot of trouble with it. <laughs> Because that's just always how it goes. Alright, give me all this. Nice. Give me all that. And give me that. Beautiful. And we can't afford any clothes. The age-old story. Can't afford clothes. Great. Mac, go do that. I feel like this music sounds pixelated. Why? <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why you gotta scare me like that, bro? Wait. Hi, hi, common, common. You have four temperance, right? You're not gonna die, right? I'm counting on you. <laughs> Uh, meanwhile, let's send in Piper. Look at that, I actually remembered her name. And then... You. This one, we just go in and then go out. Is that it? It was five, right? So that's one, two, three, four, five. Okay. Get the fuck out. What, are you trying to take a vacation in there? Agent N. Route. <laughs> wow. Yo, Bulk Jr. kind of fucking busted. That was a perfect work. Alright, go do that one now. Happy apple. Happy apple. <laughs> Thank god, because that apple, when it's unhappy, is a nightmare. Oh, we have a green moon coming up. Which one is that? I don't remember. That might be the robots, right? The saw blade robots? Since we have nothing that triggers off clerk deaths, we should be A-OK. -okay. Green is always the robots? Okay. That's what I thought, yeah. So, wait, the only noon ordeals that exist are the obelisks, the robots, and the clowns, right? I think it's just those three. It's purple, red, or green. That's all I remember, anyway. Oh, I am getting a fucking brain hemorrhage. I think so, it's been a while. There's other colors, but they each have tiers they skip and stuff. Yeah, cause like, orange, I've only seen in Dawn, I think. And I think that's all I'm aware of. It's just orange, green, purple, and... Fuck, I'm forgetting what colors exist. Red. <laughs> okay. All 
I mean, we're at capacity. Right now, we're just kind of speed running meltdowns. There we go. Wait. I shouldn't have triggered that yet. <laughs> Oops. Uh, everyone get the fuck in that elevator. This is fucking, like, actual eye cancer. <laughs> Everyone's okay, right? Nobody has taken... Oh, you've taken some damage, but that's from your work. Oh, wait. Yeah, you need to get the fuck in there. Don't die, please, thanks. So now if that guy walks in here, he's just gonna regret it. Wait, did he walk in there? I think he walked in there. <laughs> yeah, it looks like he walked into the fucking elevator that everyone was waiting in. <laughs> uh, everyone, to the elevator, please. Literally everyone, get in that elevator. Okay, at least these guys don't break... Uh, abnormalities out of prison. What are you doing? Oops. Okay, you get in that elevator, thanks. I feel like maybe we should actually move everyone in here so they can heal. What the fuck? There was a guy in there? Um... Uh... Wait, so everyone's okay, right? No. <laughs> How did she die? How the fuck did Piper die? <laughs> when did that happen? Meanwhile, everyone else is full health. Why did you guys not do that from the start? You're not telling me that they were standing in the elevator not fighting back, right? That's not possible, right? Where are these other guys? You. Well, we fucking lost Piper. Go. Wait. Get this guy. Okay, now get this guy. I foresee a Piper 2 next pay cycle. <laughs> we'll see. Piper wasn't named after anyone. So maybe we can just, uh, let her... <laughs> just let her, uh, fall out of the timeline. Where is this guy? There he is. Is he the last one? I don't see any others. Thank you. Okay. Well, I am a little disappointed that we're not going to get a ton of lob from beating this. But, you know, Piper is like... Minimum loss. Minimal losses with Piper. I can't tell what fucking meltdown we're at right now. Yeah, I get it. You've been wallowing in despair for such a long time. Oh, Piper probably died because I didn't get rid of this shit, right? That's probably what happened. Like, a named character dying is way worse, IMO, <laughs> than one of the, the like, NPC mob um, employees dying. 
Like if one of one of the viewer characters died, then I might have to reset. I also find it insane that this counts as being able to see this guy. <laughs> because I can't see anything. <laughs> it's so bad. One, two, three. One more. And then we have a meltdown coming. I can't tell if that's a three or an eight, but I'm guessing it's an eight. It's just an eight with half of it missing. As long as we don't get a dusk ordeal, I think we'll be fine. Oh, what was it? So this morning, I was looking up synonyms for sitting pretty, because that sounded like kind of a dumb fucking thing to say. Uh, but I don't remember. There was like hog happy. Oh, in hog heaven or something. And I love that phrase. I'm going to start using that. Yeah. We are in hog heaven. Lobotomy dorporation. That's you, Vincent V. You're the lob dorp. Get dorped on. <laughs> uh oh. So I was the one who couldn't see a single step ahead. That was it? Wait, what? We were that fucking close the whole time? <laughs> I can't even see who leveled up! It, it persists that long? We got 18 lobs. One death. Someone leveled up. I think that's Vincent V. I think you leveled up, Vincent V. You know who didn't level up? Pi yeah, well, fuck Piper, man. What do you want me to look her in the eye? <laughs> um. Hey, so we could get Yin. We could get the silent orchestra. We could get a swan. The silent orchestra is an A left. <laughs> but it's, uh. It might be a decent A left to have, actually. But also the black swan that dreams of being a white swan. I kind of want orchestra. I hope orchestra doesn't suck baby ass. Yeah, I want to find out more about orchestra. Leticia. Feathers. Bearing the hope to return to dust, it shall go back to the grave with all that desires to- Nope. I heard about Elijah. I'm sorry. I guess now everyone should know that there are consequences to forcefully entering a laboratory with restricted access. Also, you were very careless not to put the supply room key back in its proper place. You may think I'm being too strict, but I can't help it. I'm not saying anything false. We should set up a time for when keys must be returned to prevent people like you from causing this again. This is like when I'm at work and we have bathroom keys and people don't return the fucking bathroom keys so they all go missing and then we have to go on like a hunt for who took all the goddamn bathroom keys. <laughs> like just stop taking the keys. Don't put it in your pocket. I wore this to prevent chemicals from splashing on my body. Don't worry, I'm just a little tired. Yo, low-key, I might go down the Yasad route because when I go hiking, I wear, like, the long pants with long socks, tuck my pants into my socks, tuck my shirt into my pants, wear, like, long sleeves. I don't think I wear gloves because that's a little extreme. But, like, I go full fucking, like, everything tucked into everything so that no bugs get in my clothes. Like, I don't want to deal with ticks. One time when I was younger, I got a tick on my belly button. That shit was traumatic because it would not let go. We like lit a match on it. We poured alcohol and tried to drown it and nothing would get that tick off my belly button. And I think eventually we like finally got it off. What We also like got tweezers or something. I don't remember what was the thing that finally worked, but I think it was a combination of everything because that tick was tanky. 
and uh, that was a huge tangent. Anyway, I'm just a little tired. No need to show concern. I'll go prepare for the upcoming experiment. What were we talking about? <laughs> Wounds have a way of revealing themselves even for those who wish to keep them concealed. For Gabriel, it was the change in his clothes. Maybe it was easier on his mind to conclude that Elijah's death was caused by a violation of the rules. He tried harder to stick to his principles. He tried to maintain his objectivity. But perhaps his excessive rationality is what destroyed him. His earnest hope to not see anyone else die couldn't reach me. No, there is no point in lying anymore. I pretended that I didn't hear his desperate cry. What is this? Are we just giving A therapy? There's no need to ask if I'm doing alright. I heard about what you and I did yesterday. I felt like it was the first time I lost myself. It was not quite pleasant, but it was not as terrible as I expected it to be, either. Rather, I feel relieved. Not to say that all the hatred that surrounds me has completely washed away. I'll still see that rotting hallucination, and sometimes I'll feel disgusted, and have an unbearable anger towards you. What? Towards me? What did I do? I didn't put fucking, like, rotting meat on you or whatever, expired milk. I didn't pour the chunky milk on you, the Assad. However, if there's one aspect that has changed, it's that I can be in as much despair as I want to now. Someday a hope will painfully grow out of the rotten wound. What you gave to us was a seed of hope. Whoa! Yo, he's kind of cool looking. I like Yasad. It seems, it seems that you're also on the way to embracing your painful past. It's always the beginning that's difficult. And your outfit still isn't up to the company standard. I suppose I should seriously consider having penalty points apply even to the manager. The rationality to maintain discretion. We're germinating the seed of light. I still don't really get what's happening. Okay, so the abnormalities are getting trauma from their past lives when they were humans. And we are feeding them boxes or uh, we're basically giving them therapy right that's basically what's happening here we're giving them therapy so that they can do their jobs better mankind has yearned to build a fertile world for a long time but what did fertile really mean to them is it worthy of all the tales of conflict and pain that took place? Numerous stories began and vanished, and in that process people started to lose faith. Looking at them, some saw despair while others saw hope. Wait, is this, is this the Seed of Light story or is this the Day 23 story? At a certain moment, a new civilization was born. Wait, didn't we already read this? Yeah, we already read this. <laughs> this is like the third fucking time I've read this out loud. <laughs> I thought there was more story happening. That's two. Yes, sod synchronization completed. Look at him. The homie, I like you, Saad. 25% increase in unique PE box gains from abnormalities. Damn. The department in which the suppression took place will no longer be influenced with Klefoth Melt. That's amazing. Unique PE box gains up. Yo, we got extra gains? Okay, well now we have to suppress Hod. And from what I've heard, that is terrible. But first I want to go back to the main menu and just make sure there's no, like, story for the... Ooh, look at that lag. Look at that sweet, sweet lag. Story. Okay, the next one's at 30%. We beat Malkuth and Yasad, though. Hod's next. And then once we beat Hod, that'll unlock Netzok's fifth dialogue, and then that'll unlock his core suppression. Who the fuck are Gebera, Chesed, Hakma, and Bina? Hakma! <laughs> <laughs> Yo, who's your favorite Sephiroth? Mine's Hakma. 
knock my balls. I'm sorry. <laughs> it had to be done. Dude, hawk my balls. <laughs> when the work result was good, the counter lowered. When the work result was bad, the counter lowered. The music that is played escape consists of four movements. As the piece progresses, the employees listening will suffer white damage. The size of the audible area of the music expands. Uh-oh. <laughs> Uh-oh. Maybe I should not have picked this guy because... The counter lowers when we do good. The counter lowers when we do bad. So we can only do normal, and that is a very small range. Good is like a third of it. Bad is more than a third of it. 13 to 18, that's like a fifth of it. That's like 20%. Heck. Can we kill him? Maybe we can kill him. Ooh, I got Wah Heaven. I like that helmet. That's so cool looking. Alright, the only thing we've locked is the Thanos glove. Now what do we do? I really hope this Aleph doesn't suck. Okay, this guy's not an Aleph. Thank God. Tatiana. Eden. Max. Let's bring in Max. Okay, Max goes there. Did you do the core suppression? Yeah, we beat Yasad. Oh shit, Vincent V got the pipe! <laughs> Yo! My Twitch glitched and I missed it. Oh shit. Yes, we did beat it. Next is Hod. I am not looking forward to that shit though. Um, wait, Summer was in the center. So Hod sucks, you said? Am I gonna be miserable? I also got the silent orchestra. <laughs> and that seems like not good. <laughs> he does white damage to literally everyone. Okay, Max got horns though, so that's cool. Uh, we need to hire a lot of people. Olive? Yeah, I'll take Olive. Olive, Max, and now we need one more person for the upstairs of Central Command. Wait, so you said Clark benefits level 1, growth rate plus 1%. Okay. Wait. Yeah. Level 3 plus 5%. Oops. An error with our employees' statuses is detected. So that means I can't see health? We'll figure it out. <laughs> we will find out. So I guess... Let's put Pocky here. Let's put Christopher here. Let's put Neville here. That seems good. I need to run to the bathroom real quick. I'm going a lot today, I don't know what's going on. Alright, BRB.
Alright, it's hot o'clock. Um, should we first get more info about these guys? Just so that we know, like, for our purposes. Like, obviously we're not gonna keep that info. But no, because we'll be able to read. And that's all we really need, is just that ability, that power to understand words. Okay, there's no effect on this one, weirdly. I would have thought that it would be like gaze, but better, since it's a law. But nope. Alright, you guys get some shit weapons. Smack them on you. Give you a big ol' cannon. Grinder Mark IV? No. I'll give you Frost Splinter. He Pleasure. Okay. I think here we go, right? I can buy one of these. And... I don't know what you have. And we can't buy any of those yet. Okay. Odd time! Holy shit! Pod is cool! They're all cool! <laughs> Malkuth was kinda less cool in comparison to all these guys. Malkuth is just a box. Okay, so we got a turkey. Oh! Why the fuck? So we just have a massive debuff on everyone? Wait, that's awful. How are we supposed to do that? That's so bad. So everyone's got fucking baby stats. They literally like, have to be maxed like Bull Jr. in order to not drop any levels. That's insane. The music's dope, though. <laughs> That's sick. Um, Christopher, yeah. No. So no one can work with fucking Pingo over here. That's so bad. Okay, but yeah, so if we don't work with the silent orchestra, nothing happens. We're gonna work with it anyway. <laughs> Go, Volk Jr. We literally, like, who do we send here? Neville? Just hope it goes well. That's fucking rancid. That's rank, dude. I guess we could get that on Cloud. Alright, everyone, look here. Smile, say cheese. I want to help as much as I can here. Well, these are all just wholesome vibes. I don't understand why you need therapy. Also, who the fuck just went crazy? No one? But where did you go, then? Where did you go if you didn't go crazy? You did go crazy. Christopher, where are you? Where the hell is Christopher? There he is. Max, go shoot him. Mac, go stab him. Pocky, go shoot him. Realism, go shoot him. Weeaboo Jones and John. Actually, Weeaboo Jones don't go because you have a gun that has black damage. And Olive... If you can catch up, you are free to stab it. Who the fuck just died? Why did Cloud just die? Where? Where is Cloud and why did you die? <laughs> Excuse me? <laughs> Where? Oh, it's because- fuck. Because I misclicked and made you return the thing. Kinda cringe, dude.
That's so bad. <laughs> so we just get every stat debuffed. That's so trash. Oh, okay. What stat does Vincent V need to work on? Fortitude and Prudence? Dude. I guess let's try again. <laughs> Please don't tell me the debuff gets worse, too. Is it even winnable? Go work on that. You do that. You do that. That's why Cloud went crazy, because you got no SP. Let's send Mac here, but. This is still a banger, though. Well, shall we film educational video? What? Come on, Hod, try harder. That is a good result, which is a bad thing for us. The last one. For each movement, the weakness changed. The first movement was pale, the second was black, the third movement was white, and lastly it was red. And then it became immune to all attacks. Holy shit. <laughs> Pale, black, white, red. And only that type of damage is effective. Okay, let's do instinct work real quick. Please make sure to do it carefully and don't mess up! Will do. Thanks for the warning. What can we send here? Nara is probably fun. This is a nightmare. <laughs> I can't wait for it to get worse. Alright, Anthony, stay sane. Uh, let's start with pressure. The Firebird. It's a walk. Why though? <laughs> Why you do this? <laughs> um. This is literally elevator music. Or wait, Animal Crossing music? I'll send you here. Animal Crossing in an elevator? Don't tell me they got a bigger debuff. Because I will cry. They did. <laughs> the debuff just gets bigger every time! Wait, what? Uh oh. This is really bad. This is very, very bad. This is very, very, very bad. <laughs> Hi. Okay, we're enduring it though. So, Olive is panicking. <laughs> Why is this the music? <laughs> And these curtains just kind of stay in the way, huh? Uh-oh. There we go. Okay, so you're only weak to pale damage right now, which means we should just get everyone the fuck out. Oh wait, but someone needs to work with heaven.
Movement one. <laughs> I am so sick of recreating the same characters. Who is going crazy? Well, Junior, you want to just like wail on? He's immune. I think we already knew that though. Okay, so you... You guys all need to get the fuck out. Movement 2! Wait, what's the weakness for movement 2? Black. Uh, so who does black damage and won't go insane? You know what? I'm just gonna send in everyone. This is very bad though. So Vincent V, you actually shouldn't come. Cloud, you can come. Bulk Jr. is even struggling here. <laughs> Why is he playing elevator music? Please go kill him. This is horrible sound. Oh, I can't even speed it up? He's already in movement 4. Okay, everyone, get the fuck out. <laughs> Just get out. Everyone on every floor, get as far away from this dude as possible. The move might honestly just be to evacuate. Like, these guys are unaffected right now. Yeah, I think we just evacuate. Holy shit! Okay, they're fine though. Yeah! Okay, so we just evacuate when that dude does this shit. Just get everyone the hell out. You lose all your energy- oh. <laughs> okay. You lose all your energy. So, I kinda don't want this guy anymore. <laughs> I kinda don't like him. I also kinda don't like Hod's mission. <laughs> can't say I'm a fan. But we can't start Netzox until we clear Hod's. Fuck! <laughs> okay, so theoretically then, what we really want to do is just send as many people as possible right now. Who did I just send you? Oh wait, those, their stats will drop as soon as the meltdown happens, even if they're in the middle of a war. That's so fucked. This is hard. 
This is so hard. Why? Why do they have to be debuffed so much? Firebird, hello. Sleep off counter lowered when something else escaped. Okay. Uh, you. Oh wait, that's gonna trigger the meltdown. Yeah, we can trigger the meltdown. Holy frick, though. We need more justice on people. They are moving slow as hell. Why do I have elevator music? Orchestra didn't even break out. So I guess it wasn't the orchestra that was playing the elevator music. Going on, I. And who's the other one? Oh, it's the flower. Scuffed. So scuffed. Oh, you need to return this, so we should send someone else in. Who can we send that will get there in time? Let's hope Pocky runs. Pocky, move it! Move it, move it! Is Pocky moving it? Yeah, Pocky is moving it. I want nothing there back. That was an A left that I like. <laughs> Give me my stats back, please. What is this bird doing? It's on fire. The lower the counter, the more damage they take while working with it. Okay. Anything else I should know about? This is whack. <laughs> Sods is whack. Her <laughs> fucking core suppression. Why it do that? <laughs> Why it be that way? Granted light to Joy who worked with it when the counter was one. Oh shit. After escaping, it eventually willingly returned to its containment unit after a short while. It only displayed aggression after it was damaged and the employee whose HP or SP reached zero from its attacks died. When the Firebird was attacked, the eyes of those who injured it were scorched by the light emitted by the abnormality. Blinded employees worked at half speed. The Firebird cured Orga's eye injury when they finished the work process. Okay. Common low. What are the numbers on that? Minus 4%? Okay. Ba -ba, ba -ba. 
So we just work with it, and when it escapes, don't fight back, and it shouldn't show aggression. Wait, let's hear no. Minus eight, I don't want to risk that. But Snow White's apple would be terrible if it escaped. Let's see, Cloud, go pick that up. Uh, oh, you're fine. Oh, and since it was bad, it's not gonna escape? Oh shit, the counter went up? Wait, what? When the work result was bad, the counter increased. Oh shit. We increased the counter. <laughs> instinct. Oh, Instinct has a high success rate. Well, at least this one's straightforward. It's just a fucking terrible debuff that we have to live with. I feel like we're gonna need all of our agents for this, um, this ordeal. It's so, like, weirdly peaceful. <laughs> oh, Feather of Honor. We have so many hats. Alright, Cloud. This is relaxing. I could, like, go to sleep to this music. We might actually make it. <laughs> We're actually doing okay. Except once we have five meltdowns, I bet one of these is gonna be this motherfucker. No weapon? Oh. I guess because it's not aggressive. It kinda? Kinda got Pink Panther vibes. I also keep forgetting we have these bullets. Wait, what? Oh, ignore it. In fact, everyone get the fuck out. <laughs> 
It has like a damaging aura. Is it going back? I think it's going back. The one thing that I just cannot stand is when they, uh, when they count clerk deaths. Because <laughs> there's not really, like, after a certain point, there's not a whole lot you can do about protecting the clerks. When you need to, like, be slow and calculated. Okay, everyone back. Okay, I need someone with sanity to go here. Naraye! <laughs> I was gonna say Neville, and that's why it came out weird. <laughs> Wait, don't go, don't go, don't go, don't go. That's going to start a meltdown, and I don't want that to happen yet. Okay, I need you to put that shit back. Is it just gonna play this one song for the rest of time? <laughs> we are just trapped in the elevator for eternity. We have enough energy. Oh, but we need to get six and we're at three? Shit, we're far. We are far off from there. Um. So I need... Wait, not Christopher. Not Christopher. I need Cloud to pick that up again. In case Portcullis starts melting down. This is only the third one, and we're getting fucking minus 23 to every stat. Insane. It's minus 25 to every stat. But luckily we have the armband. We're gonna be so fucked when the noon ordeal comes around. Or I guess... Hmm. Stats don't affect damage. So we'll still do damage. But hopefully we won't die. Because we'll have really low fortitude and SP. <laughs> Um, let's send Mac. Hod's challenge kind of sucks, but... I paused it at the best moment. Look at that! <laughs> um, wait. This isn't actually how it's going to be now, right? This isn't actually what it's gonna be like, right? Did I just lose color? <laughs> Did they take away my color vision privileges? Then we have minus 35 to every stat. <laughs> and this guy's melting down? Holy shit. Well, now it is literally impossible for anyone to have enough uh, what do you call it? Fortitude for this. So that's one, two. Oh, you're melting down. Who can we send? You. Please make it in time. What's up? <laughs> How's it going, Clever B? We are listening to elevator music and losing color vision in both of our eyes. Alright, go. This is hell. <laughs> you get the fuck out. Um, 
So we need to keep this dude in our view, and I am hoping that this guy doesn't melt down. Big hoping. Are we even gonna make it there in time? Please run. I'm great, how are you? I'm good. I'm a little loopy because I'm a little tired because I uh, didn't get enough sleep last night and then had work today. Uh, the Phoenix is going on a rampage. <laughs> I think the only thing we can really do for that is tell everyone to get the fuck out. <laughs> Including that guy. <laughs> do you play a lot of Lobotomy Corp? <laughs> Oh god, we already did two core suppressions, and this one is definitely the worst one so far. Although, Yasad's gave it a run for its money, just with being una unable to see. But now, <laughs> we have that issue anyway. Okay, at least it doesn't affect these. Love you, Fishbowl. <laughs> okay, thanks, Vincent V. <laughs> I'm almost done with the game. Oh shit, nice. I cannot wait to be done with the game, honestly. Because <laughs> then I can play Library of Ruina and read the... What do you call them? The graphic novels and... Or, like, webcomics, I guess. And play Limbus Company when it comes out. But yeah, no, it's a very fun game. I'm debating right now, because I feel like... It won't be fulfilling unless I get all of the core suppressions before I beat the game. But then again, it's not, like, required. <laughs> like, you can finish the game without suppressing everything. But where's the fun in that? Wait, there are novels? Not- it's webcomics. Web- web novels, whatever. Like, Distortion Detective? And I forgot what all the other ones are called. Yeah, no, and apparently they're canon, and, like, some of them are in between this game and Library of Ruina. Yeah, so someone recommended that I read some of the, the web comics before I continue on. <laughs> Apparently they're short too. So you could read them all in one sitting. But yeah, no. Um, maybe wait until you finish the game because they might have spoilers in them. But there are webcomics. <laughs> Alright, full junior, please. Do your thing. Um, no way. We got that fucked. Actually started LOR a couple months ago. What, wait, is this L? You mean, what is LOR? Lord of the Rings? <laughs> what? <laughs> Oh, Library of Ruina. Never mind. Oh gosh, this game looks so different from it did when it released. <laughs> yeah, it's because I'm playing it on a CRT. Got tired of waiting to beat Lobotomy Corp. That might be me. Because apparently we are not super close right now. <laughs> but we'll do our best. Yeah, the game uh, really went downhill. <laughs> After Hod got involved in it. So how's all this going? Less than ideal. This is pain. <laughs> this is legitimate hell. Um, so Meltdown 5 is coming soon. We might actually make it to the end, but it's gonna be a struggle. Wait, actually? So at this point, we can just farm the easy ones because our stats are such dog shit. So if we just farm all of the easy abnormalities, get some meltdowns, pray to god that this dude doesn't melt down, um, and then I think we'll win. <laughs> it won't be the most interesting W, but it's a W. So what do you think of Library of Ruina, and why the fuck did that just happen? Oh! Because I looked away. My stream is buffering hard, let me time warp real quick, no worries. Uh, someone just died. It was Pocky. Oh, I'm so fucking... <laughs> Cause I looked away. I'm so mad at myself. <laughs> no, we were sitting here for so long. And Pocky had such good stats. We can't just let him die. <sighs> Ruin is pretty fun. Glad to hear it. <laughs> I'm really looking forward to it. I love deck building games.
I'm tilted, dude. I... One fucking miss. One minor issue. I'm so tilted, dude. You see what I mean? It has some diff- Cloud, we would have been fine if I didn't look away from this dude. But yeah, that was- that was my fault. <laughs> it has some difficulty spikes, does it? Interesting. Is it also like a roguelike type deal where you reset and shit? That goes here. Uh, Anthony here. Now right here. Let's get this shit done with ASAP. No? Oh, okay. So it's just linear though. Just progress through the story? Okay. So when there's a difficulty spike, it, you don't have to like farm for it, right? Why is there a... Oh, my screen was already dirty. I didn't even notice that. I'm currently stuck. <laughs> yeah, so what do you do about that? Do you just have to get good? Or can you like grind? Is it like resource management like Fire Emblem? Because I really like the Fire Emblem games, but Mac just died because I wasn't looking. You may need to farm a bit during spikes. Okay. I need to uh, stop looking away from that guy. It's not even that hard. Like, I just have to keep him on the screen and we'll do okay. But no. At least that one happened, like, almost immediately. So did you play this before all the updates or genuine first playthrough? Um... So I played it, like, two, three years ago. Uh, up to day 20-something. And then I kind of just dropped it. So then I decided that I would start streaming it a couple months ago. And I did a full reset, wiped all my progress. I don't remember a whole lot from when I played a couple of years ago. Uh, and we are doing a, like, kind of first, like, semi-blind playthrough. <laughs> yeah, so, um... I didn't know there were a bunch of updates. When did they update it? Was it a while ago? There are alternative paths that branch out? Oh, that's really cool. I love it when games do that. Like the, what do you call it? Unique experience, replay value type shit. I love that stuff. Alright, let's send Mac here. Send Cloud here. Send Bolt here. It had to be like three years ago. Oh shit, yeah. So then I definitely played this game after all the updates. I don't think I've played it before that. <laughs> Why? What did they change? Just like balancing stuff? So you played this game that long ago, huh? It's been around a long time. I think it was like, yeah, two, three years ago that I played it. Okay, we can send Cloud here, now that he has enough stats. Okay, we got the, the blessing. Alright, enjoy this music while you can, because we are getting elevator music soon. The mechanics used to be different. Oh, really? <laughs> it used to be simpler? No way. So I'm playing the hard version of the game? <laughs> That's kind of fucked up. It's fun though, I like it. <laughs> I don't know how it was before, but post-update, it's a fun game. It's a good game. Alright, Cloud, get in there again. This is gonna cause a meltdown. Hopefully, we're okay. Best odds would be this melts down. Thank you. That's perfect. Favorite abnormality so far? Ooh, that's a tough one. I really like um, the 
Aleph, black one with a ton of eyes on it. <laughs> I forgot what he's called, but I'd love him. He's just like a black ball covered in, like, faces. I checked in more than- whoa! Five years ago? Holy shit. <laughs> I honestly, I don't know when the game came out. So five years ago is long ass time. Um, can we send Anthony? Will he make it in time? Wait, he doesn't have enough freaking stats. Pocky, go. Run, please. Uh, let me see actually. So, I don't know the name of the guy or of the, yeah, Mountain of Smiling Bodies. Is that it? The one, he has really cool armor. Where the fuck is Weeaboo Jones? Uh, here he is. Yeah, that armor. I love that suit. It's so cool looking. Uh, I also like nothing there because he's Aleph level, but he was like the easiest to like handle out of all of my Alephs that I've ever seen. <laughs> he was the most reasonable out of everyone. My least favorite would have to be um, Express Train to Hell because I fucking hate that one. I always forget it exists and then I have to um, restart because it ran over a bunch of people. <laughs> Do you have a favorite clever? Smile gear? Oh, I don't think I know that one. What, um, what danger level is it? For good reason. What about White Knight? <laughs> that was fun. I loved having to reset my entire fucking game when that happened. <laughs> Top 10 video game experiences. Choo choo! Choo choo is right. I have fucking PTSD. I will never be selecting Express Train to Hell. Let me time warp real quick? Okay. Yeah, I don't know what's going on. Uh, My thing is green, so I don't think it should be my end, hopefully. Cause like, I have ethernet and shit. <laughs> it might just be a Twitch issue. What is- yeah! Wait, what is Smile Gear? Oh, the Smile's Gear. I got you. I know what that means. I thought- so- <laughs> When I asked What's your favorite? You said Smile Gear is epic, and I thought Smile Gear was an abnormality. <laughs> but I realized you're talking about Smiling Bodies as gear now. Okay, that took me a little second. Um, yeah, so... What would you say your favorite is? If it's one I don't know, then obviously, like, I can't say much for it. <laughs> But I'm curious about, like, the name at least, and maybe I do know it. Maybe your favorite's, like, Organ Santa or something. Fucking hate Organ Santa. <laughs> Sorry if he's your favorite. <laughs> Let me think a bit. Okay, go for it. I like how this one debuffs you and fucks you visually. I just can't get over that. Alright, everyone go upstairs. Run from the phoenix. One of my favorites is Queen of Hatred. Really? I like her, but she is such a pain to deal with. I had her on my first run on this save. And she caused so many problems. She just turned into a dragon and fucking laser beam all of my employees. I got it too? Oh no. It ain't that bad? Really? You one shot? No way. Oh, well I guess you have all Alef stuff, right? I wish this stream wasn't only 1080p. Can I do something about that? How do you add, like, options for that, actually? Because if I would, I could. 
I have hella Aleph stuff. Okay, so that's why. <laughs> you fucking melted her. See, I had her when I had no Aleph stuff, and it was terrible. <laughs> she would just kill everyone with one laser beam. I could not put people in the same fucking row as her. Me just trying to figure out how the game works now. It's really that different. Oh, and Cheese Gremlin, thanks for the follow. <laughs> I missed it completely, sorry. Um, yeah, no, okay. So, how, how different is it? Like, where do I need to start explaining? <laughs> where do I begin? Is this Phoenix gonna go back to its thing now? It is. Okay, perfect. So yeah, the treatments are entirely different. There appear to be a lot more abnormalities. Okay, yeah, so there's a ton of abnormalities. Um, I'm assuming the thing about how you start with no info about them, and then you have to work with them, get boxes, spend the boxes to unlock the guidelines and shit is the same, I'm hoping. Um, and then you can buy gear using boxes too. The boxes didn't exist before. Oh, okay. So when you work with them, on the left, you have like this success rate, you get boxes. Um, these boxes become like the boxes for that guy, and then you use the boxes to unlock information, get weapons and armor and shit. Yeah, and then they have four different kinds of work with preferences on each one. Right now we are trying to suppress Hod, and she is causing a lot of problems because every time we get a meltdown, our stats drop by like another 10 points. <laughs> and she is also visually just completely fucking the game. Uh, actually, cancel the return. Yes. That's the gist of things, I think. I'm assuming it was still like a 2D, you send people places thing. Let's see, Nara, you go there. Um, You know what? <laughs> no, wait, we can't phone this in. No, we can phone it in. That part's the same? Okay. <laughs> so it was always Fallout Shelter. That's the only game I can think of to compare this to. Like, do you know other games that are like this? Uh-oh. Um, this is a really bad distribution for these guys. Okay, you guys are fine. You guys go get that one. That's good, right? Please, stop them! Why are you doing so little damage? Okay, amazing. Um... Who's still alive? You! Get him! You guys... Got him? Okay. Who else is left? It's just the one guy? I think so. No! Oh fuck! I looked away! I was doing things! I had to look away! Oh, I shouldn't have sent someone to do that. There's definitely other task management games, but none as linear as this? Okay. Like 2D cross-section though, you mean? Because I know there's like... What the fuck are the games? Um... That one. Uh, the one with the planet, RimWorld. Because that's task management, but that one's like, top down. I am so upset that we have to fucking start over again. I'm gonna stop working with this guy. He has caused us nothing but pain. You know, I'm gonna start getting fucking cheap boxes for all I care. Yeah, go. 
I'm on tilt right now. That's a B. Go work on your fortitude. Wait, the good news is we can do prudence work with this guy now. They still have to have low prudence though. John? Let's send John. Okay. Now, RimWorld is a game that I want to stream eventually, but I'm like terrified. <laughs> Because that game feels like it's very complicated, and I don't know if I'm up for that. But it also looks like a really fun game. Uh, Mac, go here. You'll be fine. Yeah? Have you played before, Cloud? I feel like all my people are gonna get, like, fucking dysentery and chew each other's legs off or something. Or whatever happens in that game. <laughs> we'll get, like, invaded by dudes with hand grenades or something. I can't believe I have to buy the Firebird's info for the fucking third time. It's got a learning curve, but once you figure it out, it's not that bad. Okay. Damn, y'all all played it? <laughs> it definitely looks really fun. Like, I like watching other people play it. That's why I was like, hmm, I want to buy this. Uh... You. Get in there. I wish everyone would rely on me. Ooh, sad boy vibes. And how does that make you feel, Hod? Armchair psychologist Bulg is in the house. Go, Mac. Just, yeah, like, because in RimWorld, there's those menus all over the place. But I feel like, yeah, once you, like, learn the game, then it's a really fun game. And there's like a lot of freedom, uh, like a lot of really unique stuff that could play out in your game. And I love games that do that. Where it's like you can have your own fucking RimWorld lore. Alright, did I send someone? I did, didn't I? Yes. Okay, let's send Pocky here. I need my glasses. I've been staring at this screen too long. Bruh, so much time has passed, and we are technically on the same day we started on, I think. <laughs> because I ended up memory repoing, because we got two fucking Alephs while we were doing Yes Odds Challenge, so I was literally blind. Trying to deal with these Alephs. Also, it gave us a little extra time to deal with this shit. Anyway, I feel so free now that we've started ignoring this dude. Uh, yeah, I don't need your weapon. Fuck out of here. What kind of damage does it do? Red? <laughs> White damage or bust? Oh no, this is bad. Um... That's risky, because normal results on this dude make him escape. The King of Greed is also pretty fucking cool. Like, he's... I put him in, like, A tier on my favorites list. Because he has the, the hand gift, and then his weapon is just a huge fucking fist. It's so cool. I can't show you right now. Or wait, yeah, no, it's on the top right there. I don't like nothing there's armor, though. Because it's, like, too vibrantly red. It's like ugly. It's garish. Neon. Do 
I'm back. Welcome back, clever. Having some issues, huh? With the internet. That used to happen to me all the time until I got um, Ethernet. People used to always rave to me. They would be like, Ethernet is so amazing. Like, why do you use wireless internet? And I was like, I don't know, because it's easier. And then I got a fucking Ethernet cable. And <laughs> it's like I have never had issues with Wi-Fi. On my desktop, at least. Any other computer is still subject to random fucky wuckies. My ethernet kind of sucks, I think. Oh, really? That is unfortunate. <laughs> so I guess it's not just by merit of using ethernet, it's good. You have to have good ethernet. That sucks. Its speed fluctuates a lot. Oh, shit. Oops. It's back down again? No, clever! <laughs> uh, which one do we have to fight? Honestly, my fix did not work. Oh, no. My fix is just wait, but... I guess that's kind of a pain in the ass. Okay, hang on. Who's in this department? You two. Okay. Who's in this department? Who are you guys suppressing right now? This one? Oh, it is this one. Okay. Um... You three. Wait, here's the actual move. It's holding up for now? Okay. I am glad to hear it. Now, let's send the people from whatever the fuck this one is called. Safety team? Yeah, safety team goes here, and now the middle one, info team, goes here. It's probably gonna dip or something? Shit. Bad timing. Fix it! <laughs> Quick! <laughs> call them to come, uh, like, call some electricians. <laughs> this guy we can ignore, right? It's already starting to buffer again? Shit. Go, 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 go. They're not gonna make it in time. Porcubus, uh, just fight this one then. It's always like this? Oh, man. I don't think I would survive. <laughs> I'm too addicted. Uh oh. Okay. Uh, you guys... Why don't you all... Get this guy. And did we get all the guys upstairs? It's only lately staying low. That's whack. You should complain to them. Can't believe, uh... Internet services charge money... To not work. <laughs> I don't know. Um, up until very recently, I lived in a, an apartment that, like, had... Because it was part of a community, so it had, like, built-in internet, and it was really nice. Uh, and the internet was fast as fuck. It was, like, 800 whatever the speed is, like, megabytes per second or something. It was insane. Um, now I'm back home. So it's, like, decent, but... Not as fast as it was then. <laughs> that internet was insane. I don't know why the fuck it was like that. And then my roommate got an ethernet cable, and her, it, like, internet was nowhere near as, as fast. So I don't even know what, like, why that was going on. Okay, we're at three right now. My ethernet isn't directly connected, it's a wireless ethernet thing, I'm not sure if it's any big... Really? Wireless Ethernet? I've never heard of that. I thought Ethernet was, like, inherently wired. Because you have to plug in the Ethernet cable. I don't know. 
It sounds kind of scuffed to me, honestly. <laughs> I would treat wireless anything the same as Wi-Fi. I don't know. When I go to work, though, the break room has no fucking cell signal, and it's god-awful. Because it's like the break room is, first of all, hellish, and then there's just no internet. So, and then there's like dividers because, uh, I guess during the pandemic, they put those up in the break rooms to stop the spread. Like that's going to do anything. Um, uh, so it's hella antisocial. So it, the whole thing is just a bad vibe. Cloud, you go here. It's wired, but it isn't. So it's wired, but not to, I don't know how that works. That's just confusing. <laughs> That's too complicated for it to actually be a real thing. Wait, what? Oh, because it escaped. I was like, why didn't we finish this? Did Bulk Jr. die? But no, he's fine. Luckily. Alright, I think we're gonna make it to 500. We're only halfway there. <laughs> Like, we're more than halfway to 500, but we're only halfway to the meltdown level we need to get to. Fucking hard, man. There's a part that plugs into the wall and to the router. So then what about that isn't wired? Because it's, it's... Like, and then the router's plugged in, right? So then that is Ethernet, I think. Like, mine plugs into the wall. I think that's standard. I don't know. I'm not fucking... Linus Tech Tips or whatever. Um, I used to be a CS major, and then I decided, no. <laughs> I, like, yeah, so there's an Ethernet port in my wall right now, and I plugged an Ethernet cable into my, my desktop, and then plugged that into the wall. I don't know if there's wires running through the wall to my router, Probably something like that. I don't know. Even when I did do comp sci, I was a software guy, not a hardware guy. I did build my own computer, but I don't think that really uh, is relevant when we're talking about <laughs> Ethernet. <laughs> I didn't build the Ethernet in my apartment. It's like a brick. I don't know what that means. <laughs> I got nothing. I have no words. <laughs> what the fuck? It's a brick? Wait, this one is two... Under two. Okay. One of those charger bricks. So it plugs into the brick and then into the wall? Like a fucking Mac charger? <laughs> This is so peaceful. <laughs> We're just talking about Ethernet, listening to actual elevator music, and nothing is happening <laughs> in the game. <laughs> it's a little slower, I think, because we're not using this guy, but better safe than sorry. The brick connects to the router. You're losing me. I'm just gonna give some half-assed advice and say real, real ethernet, please thanks. <laughs> okay, and I love being blind. My favorite thing to do. There's a second brick that could- Why are there so many bricks? <laughs> oh, this is bad. So, let's send Weeaboo Jones here. Uh, let's send Bolt Jr. here. That's a two, yeah. Let's see, who can we send here? Uh, Anthony. Now you should return this. Oh fuck, and then this one's happening. I guess Narai. You've got a brick that connects to a brick that connects to the computer. <laughs> Why are there so many bricks? <laughs> Just get wires. <laughs> No bricks unless they're hard drives. I'm banning bricks. 
The word brick is gonna be a banned word in my chat. <laughs> so I think the peacock's gonna escape. Yep. Alright everyone. Oh fuck, I just pulled up the whole ass history. I pulled up all the chat logs. Okay, um, we need to work with this guy. Nare, please hang in there. How do I get rid of this shit now? There we go. Okay, normal result. That's ideal. Now, the chicken is escaping. Chicken is in the building. This guy, still at two. Beautiful. Porcubus, fuck you. Snow White's apple, still at one. The bricks wirelessly connect. Okay, so... <laughs> so the bricks are friends. They can communicate telepathically, like Liza and Tate from Pokemon Sapphire and Ruby. Um, so you've got the Liza brick and the Tate brick. And the Liza brick's plugged into the computer, the Tate brick is plugged into the router. I don't understand <laughs> what that's supposed to accomplish. Why not just get... <laughs> what, like, what, what's better about the bricks than normal Ethernet? What do the bricks have that the wires don't? <laughs> okay, so it's just mystery. It's mystery bricks. Not sure. <laughs> okay. So you just kind of got bricks. And they're just chilling there. Alright, we're at four. We have a meltdown coming up. Oh shit! Mac got the pipe! Yo! Mac with the pipe! We're gonna have to start calling her crack and cheesy. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, Mac. <laughs> So, can I buy shit? Thank god there's something in color. Uh, show me repression. Low. Okay. That's fine. Uh, show me this one too. Escape info. Give me some guidelines. I legit don't know why or not. <laughs> Amazing. It just isn't. Wait, the thing is I can't even connect to the Wi-Fi because my computer isn't built to do that or s What? Are you sure? Usually when you plug in Ethernet, like, the Wi-Fi options disappear, I think? That's weird, though. So you just don't have, like, a Wi-Fi receiver on the computer? I mean, worst comes to worst, you could buy one of those externally and then attach it. But, um, that's weird. Why would they... Why would you have a computer that isn't built to connect to Wi-Fi? Alright, now we're just gonna speedrun this shit. I've tried everything. Go, Vincent D. My XIT mother said that it needs to be built in. Really? Let me time warp real quick. Okay. <laughs> Might be able to crank out a meltdown right now. As long as no one kills themselves. The entire time the stream's been stuttering? Oh, I'm so sorry. I honestly, I admire your dedication. <laughs> that would be so frustrating for me. Can I please have color back? <laughs> please, thanks.
If I had wings, I'd. F Why are you sending fucking weird, like, lovey dovey messages to me, dude? <laughs> Where is this coming from? <laughs> my upload speed and download speeds are like three? Oh my god! And you don't live in Brazil? It's fucking Vince v. Stream is good for me. I'm using a Nokia flip phone. Oh, dude, take a screenshot of me. Wait, and let me do... There we go. No, I'm not living in Brazil. Damn. That was the only explanation I, I had. Yeah. So you had the same service and it just got worse. In that case, you should totally just complain to the ISP. I think that is the time to be like, why? Why are you doing this? Why you have to be shit? Alright, we have six meltdowns coming up. I realized that these two departments don't melt down anymore, which means we could actually send someone from one of these to do the meltdowns, and then everyone will be available to deal with shit when it hits the fan. We are so close, though. We're so close. Where's Tiffany? She's late for her counseling session. Why isn't she here? Where's Tiffany? She's late for her counseling session. Why isn't she here? Time warping. Woo! It used to not give me any issues at all, maybe it's wear and tear. Does that happen with Wi-Fi? I feel like, shouldn't they be sending people to do like routine maintenance and stuff? Okay, who's melting down? We have a noon ordeal coming up. <laughs> Wait, but we just have to make it to six, right? So will the day just end if we get to six? You're melting down? Go Narai. Uh, Anthony. No. Yes. No. Mac, you go here. Anthony, you go here. The buffering is getting worse. It's like every three to five seconds. Jeez. You have my deepest condolences. Okay, Pocky, do that. I'm in pain. That sounds painful. <laughs> Maybe it's, uh, it's Hod's core suppression. <laughs> Maybe she's getting to your computer. Man, fuck Hod. Um, I think we should get this on Christopher. Alright, I need these guys to run. Oh, I'm realizing that since their justice is nerfed, they're gonna move at a snail's pace, too. Oh, and I need you to get the fuck out of there before I forget. Please hurry, please hurry, please hurry. Oh, you made it. Okay, I was scared. So, I think in this case, we want to just zoom in on this guy. <laughs> so that at least we can see how much progress we have. There we go. I feel like I'm playing this game fucking 20 years ago. Is there really nothing to do with stream quality? I don't know how to change it, honestly. Um, that might be a setting that I have to do in OBS. I can look it up after the stream. The 1080's killing me. I don't know what to do about that. <laughs> I don't know how to add more quality options. Is that everyone? I think that's everyone. If I could, I would. Honestly, if you can, like, tell me... <laughs> How to, how to fix it. How to like add 720p as an option or even 480 if you want to watch the stream like this game looks to me. So then the game will just be completely fucking 
unintelligible to you, <laughs> then you like be my guest. Let me look it up. Okay. Thanks, clever. <laughs> Because I will do my best, but I don't want to, like, put everything on hold. Here's, these guys have the shittest stats. Why? Why are your stats so shit? Alright, go here. Um, can I send someone to work with the... I was about to call it a clam. The, the sheep. The sheep. Um... Mac, go work with that, please. Anthony, go do that one. Is this gonna be enough? Let me also send Bulg Jr. here. I think we're gonna make it. As long as the noontime ordeal doesn't actually happen. Because it's the green one. <laughs> and those dudes have really high DPS. So if we just get fucking blasted down to zero HP with our one Fortitude employees, that would be really unfortunate. That would be very upsetting. Uh, Christopher. What kind of damage does this dude do? White, black damage. Oops. Uh, nope. I will send Christopher. Who does red damage? Do we have anyone? Oh, Poday does. Alright, Christopher. Get up here. Hang with the dog. Wait, Christopher's already there? How did he move so fast? Do, 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 do. The Firebird. Ooh, I want this outfit. Even if it kills me. Hopefully it doesn't kill me. Do, do. Do, do, do. We are so close to finishing Hod's thing. It's gonna feel so good to have decent stats again. I can't wait. Please. Please. Give me that free refill on my employees. The chug jug. Thanks. Wait, is he healing or taking damage? One of those. <laughs> uh, everyone, get in the elevator. My favorite elevator. I wonder if we're gonna get elevators on this floor eventually. Okay, I wish I could tell if there was anyone not in the elevator, but it's literally fucking impossible to see anything right now. Everyone get in that elevator. Okay. Ready? Let's see if we win, or if we have to actually deal with the noon ordeal. Vincent V, go! Yes! We win! <laughs> we won. Zero deaths. Holy shit, look at those stat buffs. <laughs> because everyone's stats dropped so low that they're not even leveling up, they're just going back to normal and it looks like they're leveling up a whole bunch. So, Weeaboo Jones got the fucking big boy fortitude now. Also has max temperance and justice, which is better than before. That's amazing. Uh, Mac now has max justice. Amazing. Temperance is now the only stat that could use a little work. Uh, John got some dog shit buffs. Uh, Narae got two points in HP, but maxed his temperance. Solid. Anthony got three points in justice. Yo, Cloud got a ton of temperance. Looking pretty good. Vincent V got two points in fortitude, but a decent amount of temperance. 
Uh, realism. Got the prudence. Summer. Uh, nothing happened to Summer. Pocky got a little bit of justice, and Christopher got literally two points in HP. We did it! <sighs> Praise the sun. Uh-oh. Uh, the Little Prince, Yin, or Schadenfreude. Imagine, we have Schadenfreude and the other one. And we have to look at that one and not look at Schadenfreude. It's also a hay, I think, right? We already have all of these. I kind of want Yin. Backward clock, giant tree sap. I guess we take this one. Do you believe that there is truly inexcusable behavior? Is this... Is this something we've read before? If we realize that in forgiving others, your enemy didn't deserve forgiveness, but rather that you needed peace, would things be better? I don't get it. Are you sure you can really join our experiment in such an unstable situation? Michelle, let me cut to the chase. We are performing experiments that go directly against the head's ideals. If your beloved parents or your precious friends try to coax you, are you confident that you'd be able to refuse them? She wasn't able to say anything to my browbeating. Carmen broke the silence instead. Don't be too harsh on her. She's amazing to be here at such a young age. Just like everyone else, Michelle liked Carmen. That was not trickery or a show. She wasn't the manipulative sort of person who'd keep up such a facade either. I should have made her give the answer she avoided speaking no matter what. Did Michelle receive what she wanted? I don't know. Did she accomplish her purpose by trampling on us and Carmen? I'll never know. Do I have any right to bear hatred towards her? The answer was no. I was no different from her. I want to check the log. <laughs> Sorry to like interrupt the flow, but okay. Do you believe that there is truly inexcusable behavior? Nobody's perfect. If we realize that in forgiving others, your enemy didn't deserve forgiveness, but rather that you needed peace, would things be better? What? So it, Angela's in favor of forgiving anything? To be honest, I never wanted you to die in misery, like that nasty tabloid article gossiped. Wait, what? So she was, uh, she was young and she died. I don't remember the circumstances of her death. Were you able to successfully face yourself, manager? When I awoke to find myself here, I thought this could be my second chance. I thought I could redeem myself and liberate myself from my mistakes. What I did can never be undone. A sunken pebble can never float to the surface again. I wanted to be a kind person. I wanted to show everyone that I might be okay here somehow. Was I truly being considerate of others? Silly me, there's no room for something like that here. I was a hypocrite. All those nice acts were for myself. I'll keep trying to be a better person, even now. It may be specious. What? What is that a word? The fuck does specious mean? Specious? Specious. <laughs> Superficially plausible, but actually wrong. Misleading in appearance, especially misleadingly attractive. Okay. I didn't know that word. And some people may hate me for that, but as long as my efforts can save a person's life or give a person the consolation they need, I will live on with that pride as a stepping stone. So, manager, let's keep trying together in this indeterminable hell. The hope to be a better person. I'm still not quite sure what Hod did. Was that in some of her earlier story and I'm just forgetting it? Are you hoping to turn back time for the things you've longed for? After all this? Even if you turn back the clock, do you really think your regrets can be so easily washed away as if nothing happened? Do you know there's a cactus on your chaotic mess of a desk? Yeah. I like cactus. The cactus will bear a flower. <laughs> be honest with me, Matt. You're not coming to these meetings with me for praise, are you? Aren't you sick and tired of this? You'll do something great tomorrow yet again, though it won't be anything all that great, and Miss Angela and the other Sephiroth will shower you with compliments. 
We'll have another accident in my department, a couple will fall down and die, some will go nuts, and a pile of them will just get injuries they'll never recover from. Hog will try and cheer me up. Yes, Hog will lecture me about what regulations I didn't follow. Malkuth will try to encourage me, lively as usual. Let's try harder tomorrow. Nobody will say to my face that it's my fault, but it'll be clear as day that I'm responsible for all of it, surely. My day always repeats like that. Starts with death, ends with death. Every employee here regularly receives a small dose of a certain drug. Did you know? It helps them become desensitized to everything. Just think about it. If your good old lunch mate is found dead, torn into thousands of pieces, who in the world would be able to clean up his dead body without a single drop of emotion? Could you blame them? Would you call them cowards for depending on drugs? Everyone's just trying to escape from this reality in their own ways. They might look and pretend to be okay, but nobody really is. I keep thinking about how I can off myself. I know, it's like a metaphor. Death for us is a hypothetical concept. I heard injecting substances like enkephalin into machines will slowly but surely rust them. Then maybe I could chug a whole bottle into my body. Give myself irreversible damage. Funny, I just injected myself with way more enkephalin than I usually do. Yet my mind is clearer than ever. Hell, I feel completely lucid right now. If I were to open my eyes again, maybe it'll be somewhere without you, those other Sephiroth, or that Angela. It hasn't been fun. Let's never meet again. Damn! Netsock fucking hates us! Holy shit! We began our research on Cogito and Ernest. The most urgent issue that prevailed at the time was the correct dosage. I tried to persuade people. I told them we have to proceed with the experiment in order to save Carmen and the others. Everyone fell silent when I asked for volunteers. Then one man quietly raised his hand. It was Giovanni, who had kept to himself for most of his time here. Giovanni was one of the patients from Carmen's company. I heard they had known each other since childhood. There is no such thing as a noble sacrifice. The end is always miserable, no matter how justifiable a cause it may be for. My statement that this experiment could bring back Carmen must have been the strongest motivation that drove him to volunteer. An experiment to find the proper dosage of a drug is not something that can be done in just a trial or two. I never talked with him much. We had nothing in common, other than our acquaintance with Carmen. Kajito emaciates the boundary of a human. And repeated experiments will leave an indel indelible mark. Alright, we gotta inject him with some Kajito! Okay, so I guess, uh, Giovanni, aka Netzok, got drugged and died and got turned into an AI. He got experimented on too hard. Alright, I want to actually go back and reread Hod's fifth story and see if I'm missing something. <laughs> Because, like, what did she do wrong, exactly? All newly contracted employees will have their stats at level 3! That's amazing. That's so good. The department in which the suppression took place will no longer be influenced by Cleefoth meltdowns. That's standard, but still really good. Oh! We also don't even have these outfits. So, I'm actually glad I picked Yen. What does it do? Um... That's it. It just escapes if you do a bad job. Excuse me, sorry about that. So now when I- holy shit, it costs one lob and they have a three in every stat. That's amazing! <laughs> That's so good, so we don't have to... Like, upgrade people for a billion lob ever again. Oh, and now we have Netsock's core suppression. An error with the healing and- oh no. Well, it's only Meltdown level 6. Shit. Healing and recovery error, though? That's bad. <laughs> that is not good for us. Uh, so who else was in this? Neville? And Christopher? There we go. And now we need two new employees. So Max and Olive have not done anything so far. To be fair, we couldn't really train them because they were receiving debuffs the entire time, so their stats were absolute garbage. We got some outfits. Alright. 
do we do Netsock next? So I think tonight I'm gonna stop here, because it's 11.30 and I have work tomorrow. Um, so I'll probably hit begin management, just so that it saves, like, how we've uh, laid everything out. Haze. Hey armor? No hay armor on anyone. That's amazing. Okay, Cloud. This armor is good. Do we have better armor though? This one's weak to black damage. What does it do? Not that one. No effects? No effects. Okay. Uh. That's cool. And then I want more Aleph armor. And then, let's see, Olive and Max, you guys are okay. So we have a green stem and a discord. So we need to hire two new people. We have two weapons available. That's kind of perfect. Uh, you. Yeah, we need white damage on you. So we have heaven. And we have another green stem. So you should take have them. Yeah, that's cool. Alright, Cloud is looking pretty cool now. Um, and then we have Olive, Bulk, Junior, Max. So, let's hire not Isabel, not LaMarcus, not Diva, not Yuri, not Oliver. Tatiana? No. Victor. No. Sergei? No. Camille? No. Dakota? I'll hire Dakota. So Dakota should wear... Carry a green stem and wear... Discord or green stem? Discord's pretty cool. Does anyone over here need better armor? Actually, I might give Vincent V Discord. So let's see. All of our department heads have unique stuff. Yeah, so let's give you a green stem. Okay. And then, uh, who should I make a character of? I guess we could revive Sin. <laughs> let's bring back Sin. So, here, Sin Virus 1337. Now, Sin is gonna have... Yo, the Joker? You're back? Welcome back, Clever. We <laughs> we won while you were gone. <laughs> nice timing. <laughs> I'm actually gonna wrap up soon, but um, did you find anything about lowering the quality? Because I will do that for uh, going forward. Okay, I need baldness. Give me some baldness on Paul. 28. I think the quality thing is given to people automatically when possible. Okay. So then there's nothing I can do about it. Alright, this is the new sim. Twitch affiliates have priority? Okay. So, you're telling me I'm two followers away from being able to, <laughs> to have quality adjustment? Holy shit. You have been frozen for me for a good 30 seconds. No! Clever! <laughs> well, you haven't been frozen for me. I don't know if you can even hear me right now. My upload speed is currently 1. That's fucked. That's kind of ridiculous, actually. That's, like, comically bad.
That one. There we go. There's Sin. Back in charge. Let's put Bulb Jr. here. Still frozen. Shit. Well, I'm ending stream soon. <laughs> I don't know uh, if you can hear me. Probably not, huh? Alright, well for now, Sin should take a weapon from someone else. Uh, take it from Dakota. And let's give Dakota another shitty hay level weapon. Still frozen? No! No! Take that one. Hold on a sec. Okay, I mean I'm ending stream soon. <laughs> Let's just begin management. Uh, yeah. And then it'll save when I start. Yes. Now, what is this? Flesh cross. So we can stick someone on a flesh cross. I want to see what the flesh cross does, and then we can end. Alright. Time to flesh crucify them, I guess. Get on there, Olive. Oh, you take pale damage while you pray? Oh, you take random damage while you pray? What does it accomplish, then? What? <laughs> Flesh Idol. Okay. Flesh Idol's effect can manifest through prayer. The one who prays will receive damage of a random type at regular intervals. The meshing of flesh and scrap metal. It is speculated to be a religious artifact found in the flooded district. In the past, some people saw answers through religion. When an employee offers up a prayer, the flesh begins to move as if receiving the oration. The subject prayed for a duration of 20 seconds or less. They died. Don't die, Olive. Hang in there, Olive. Don't die, Olive. Keep praying. Keep praying to that flesh cross. Okay, what's this? The subject prayed for a duration between 21 to 45 seconds during this time frame. All employees other than the subject recovered HP. How the fuck am I going to count 21 to 45 seconds? The supplicant will suffer various ordeals in a manner like being put through a trial. Meanwhile, all those around them will recover their ails and woes just as if they were being blessed with redemption. Oh, okay, so everyone's healing while Olive is praying here. Okay, you need to get the fuck out. Now let's send Bogue Jr. in to pray. Did you see any of my past messages? I saw all of them. Yeah. Or like, I, you said I was frozen, right? That's all I saw. But they all showed up on time. So your like, upload speed is fine. Maybe. And your download speed is just shit? I don't know. I'm pretty sure I saw all of your messages. Can you hear me now at least? <laughs> Frozen? Fucking hell. <laughs> I guess even if I messaged in chat. Okay, you're back. Welcome back, Clever. <laughs> I was actually gonna wrap up soon, but you said affiliates <laughs> get priority. I'm so close, that's so fucking frustrating. The prayer shall inevitably end with the eternal despair of its worshiper. The subject prayed for a duration between 46 to 90 seconds. The results were similar to experiment two, but SP was also recovered. Just keep praying, Bull Jr. It's stuttering. Alright. Well, still painful. Hopefully you can figure it out. <laughs> I am gonna just... Once we get all this info... I'm gonna... Gonna wrap things up. What? Why'd that happen? Why did literally every creature escape? Why did literally everything escape? What? Why did it... Stop screaming at me. I can't speed it up. Wait, how is everyone dead? What the fuck is that? Oh, it's the spike thing. I can't look away from it.
classic flesh idol moment. That's the... <laughs> that's what the flesh idol does? I need that fucking Mac to make her way down here and pray, <laughs> please. Where are you, Mac? Okay, now we get the horrible ringing sound. Wait, what? It's not Mac. Oh, it's Jammed Cloud, but Jammed Cloud's insane. Everyone's dead. Go, Pocky. The stuttering is so annoying. That's really annoying. <laughs> I'm so sorry, Clever. So, Pocky is uncontrollable? Why? You're fucking sleeping? Wake up! Go to work! <laughs> okay. I just want to see what the last info from Flesh Idol is. Literally everyone died. But, we'll get some information. <laughs> Hopefully. This is so scuffed. Flesh Idol really released all the dude. Okay, the stut. <laughs> nice. Good one. <laughs> it stuttered just now as you were typing that. Well, it was a funny, it was a funny bit. <laughs> Come on, Pocky, pray for Esther. Three minutes required. Longer than 90 seconds, they died and all of the counters dropped to zero, okay. So I have to count 90 fucking seconds. Okay. I'm lost in time. Clever! <laughs> Don't worry, you'll be free. I'm wrapping up. <laughs> Your words... Yeah, how does that happen? How come it only works one way for you? <laughs> okay. Olive, Dakota, Max, Cloud, Sin. We got some cool ass individuals here. Okay. Return to main menu. I'm gonna take OD screenshots once I end stream. <laughs> Cause this shit's cool. Forever in the past, never able to reach the future. Oh, that's depresso. Maybe someday you'll reach the future. Or at least the present, right? Like maybe don't aim so high. So Try to make it to the present, and then maybe someday you'll get to the future. But, um, yeah, that's gonna do it for me. We did three suppressions. I think we have a pretty solid, um, lineup of abnormalities at the moment. So, we should be set. I don't think I mind getting a memory repository, uh, after this, like, with this set. This is probably a good set to get a, a memory repo for um but yes i'm wrapping up i think my next stream is going to be sunday i don't usually schedule streams for sundays but i will have this sunday off uh and so i'm thinking i'll probably stream i don't know if i'm going to stream lobotomy corp although i do love this game um yeah because we did stream it twice in this week, and maybe we need a little bit more variation. Actually, I'm gonna have to look over the list of games we we're playing right now. Uh, maybe we start a new game. Maybe we pick something back up. But like, I don't know, I haven't really been in the mood to play Bloodborne or Okami in a while. Um, you recommend installing mods that show you stuff like percentages for work? Mm, maybe not for my first playthrough. I might do it if I play through the game again. But I, uh, I want to beat the game kind of like vanilla first. So yeah, thanks for the, for the recommendation though, Clever. And Clever, thank you so much for the follow. Much appreciated. Hopefully when you come back later on, <laughs> things will be less frustrating for you. I'm really sorry about your internet. 
Uh, Vincent V, peace, peace out, my guy. Thank you so much for hanging out. Um, yeah, I had a lot of fun playing this game. I really, I love this game. I can't wait to play Library of Ruina. So I have half a mind to just binge this shit, beat it, then we can play Ruina. Um, just because, like, spoiler paranoia, because I get so fucking anal about spoilers. Um, and yeah, I can't really help it. It just, it's, spoilers are my trigger. <laughs> trigger warning spoilers. <laughs> Um, yeah, but anyway, um, that's gonna do it for me. Shiny hunting on Arceus is not gonna happen, ever. Um, <laughs> maybe we'll shiny hunt on the new Pokemon games. Don't count on it, though, because that is $60 that I don't know if I want to give to Game Freak. Uh, but we'll see. So, yeah. Um, anyway, I'll catch you guys on Sunday, probably. Let's just say Sunday. Yeah, I'll catch you guys on Sunday. Um... Shit, I gotta advertise shit. So if you made it this far in the live stream or in the VOD, consider following on twitch.tv slash fishbulg if you aren't already, because I really appreciate the support. I think we're one follower away from 50 and then we can uh, we can apply for affiliate. So <laughs> if anyone wants to be that one, uh, please uh, hit me up. But um, hopefully things will get better indeed. Not sure if you realize how far back I am. Wait, I'm a time warp or something. I don't think you're that far back. You might be like a minute or something back. Um, but yeah, no, the hopefully things will get better. I don't think that's something I said that long ago. Um, yeah, but anyway, um, yes. Also from my about page, a minute is too far. No, I just said that, but I guess you just time warped. So yeah, um, cause I said that like 20 seconds ago. But yeah, a minute is a huge delay, you're right. <laughs> and I have it set to like minimal delay, so uh, it's, that's annoying. Like I wanted to keep it as kind of like in tune as possible, but I guess that's just the limits of streaming. Um, yeah, so anyway, also from my about page, you can uh, click the banners to join the Discord, uh, check out my Twitter and check out the VOD archive, uh, any of that if you're interested. Um, the Discord, aside from being able to just hang out, kind of like small community in there, um, share like dumb shit posts, study Japanese and other weeb shit. Uh, you can also join, what's it? You can get a role that will ping you every time I go live. So if you don't want to miss a stream, uh, I highly recommend doing that as it's a little bit more reliable than Twitch notifications. Um, yes, and you can also do exclamation point discord in chat for that. We do have like a couple nightbot commands. Um, yeah, that's it. Uh, I finally got through my fucking like five minute long spiel. Um, yes, that is how you do it, clever. <laughs> Thank you. The limits of your internet. It's, well, no, because it's the limits of your internet, but also like I have noticed there's like a delay um, even with like people who have good internet. <laughs> <laughs> there's uh there's a bit of a delay there's like more of a delay than i would like there to be um i would like it if it was like almost um what's the word like at the same time um almost synchronized but yeah i think that's a little too much to hope for uh there should only be a couple seconds yeah ideally like i don't know on obs and on twitch i think i have all the settings set to like the minimum delay so i don't know what the issue is here Vincent V, um, I'm gonna fucking eject you. Okay. And, uh, <laughs> with that, good night, everyone. Make sure to vote to eject Vincent V on your computers, <laughs> and I will catch you on Sunday. So, peace out. Thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.